Hello! <laughs> How is everyone? Oh, what is going on with my camera? Always the way. How are you all? I hope you're having a beautiful day. I'm excited to be here on YouTube. Uh, something new. We're usually on Twitch, I know. Uh, something a bit different. <laughs> um, I'm excited and curious to see where this takes us and what all this is about. Hi, Maddie, you're still here. How are you, Maddie? It's so nice to see you. How has your week been so far? I feel so weird being on YouTube. I don't know, there's so many new things I need to get used to over here. I'm every, you know, the layout's all different. Everything else is a little bit different. Also, I don't know, I have so many things I'm learning. I just wake up, you're having a pre-stream, <laughs> Maddie. You're really sweet. What time is it there for you now? I, I want to know because I'm gonna start potentially, hopefully, planning for streams on weekends. Weekends my time, so I can sort of work better with um, other time zones. There we go. <laughs> so you don't have to get home pre-stream nap, so you awake at stupid o'clock in the morning. Because I'd love to have you hang out when you're, when it's a reasonable time for you. The same with a lot of other people. Oops. Damn it. <laughs> Patty, go to sleep. I do really appreciate it. You're crazy. Absolutely crazy. Need to fix this one now. There we go. Oh, I want the next one up, actually. What is it? What's next one up from 1920 by 1080? Is it 1440? I think that's the one. I just, I just moved my Hogwarts Legacy game and it accidentally made it full screen and I needed to find a way to bring it back. <laughs> Is it craziness or determination? I would say a little bit of both. A little bit of both. <laughs> I do really appreciate your support though, Maddie. This is so, so lovely. I really do appreciate it. I hope you're having a wonderful week though. And I hope that it doesn't interrupt too much with your day-to-day -day life. Cause I will be live for a little bit. That's my biggest concern. I, I know everyone here can look after themselves and they know what's going on, but I like to make sure that you guys are okay and you're not sacrificing your life so you can be here and hang out. Stay with me while I tidy this up. I'm gonna interrupt anything else actually. <laughs> Thank you, Maddie. You're so sweet. I'm I'm really excited to, I'm really excited for this next journey on YouTube. I I've, I've been planning this for a while and they just changed their partner program which is really exciting for for me. Um, and a lot of other new uh, new streamers. Content creators. <laughs> so now we don't need as many to tick off as big a milestone which is awesome. Life game is don't have wives we just move from one side quest or another until it becomes a main quest yeah yeah that's it's pretty true <laughs> and hopefully eventually it gets there how are you finding hogwarts how is your character going where are you up to what is going on why you tell me all about that i'm gonna jump straight in let me move into gameplay first so you can see do let me know if there is anything that I'm missing or needs to be adjusted. I feel like my camera is a bit. Oh, I don't want to move that. Hold on, hold on a second. Also, my game is too big. Excuse me. Hold on one moment. This one. I think it's full screen at the moment. Yeah. Why are you full screen? Oh, okay. Oh, I needed a game to actually be there. Got it. How weird. Okay. It's just going a little weird. That's fine. I made a video where I put the <laughs> Rhythm Professor Garlic. Did you? <laughs> I 
You love Professor Garlic, hey? <laughs> I mean, you know, it's. I think it's fair. I think it's fair. I think Professor Garlic is so lovely. I just need to make sure my webcam's okay. It's feeling feeling a little off. I don't know why. I was expecting hiccups for my first stream, so it has not disappointed. Why can't I move that up? Oh, there we go. It is what it is. Great. <laughs> you still on the quest to learn. I ha I didn't even learn it with my other with my. See, I've got Juliet here as well. I didn't learn it with my other character either. I finished the story quest, so it's definitely on a side quest. Also, let me know if this is too loud, or if anything's too loud, or if anything's just off. <laughs> it's it's one of those things at the moment. Oh gosh, just got a random like gust of wind behind me. Okay, where was I up to? I need to learn disarming charm. Okay. Sounds good. Amazing. Thank you, Maddie. I don't think I can do this now. Best to come back. I, I heard you the first time, Karen. Thank you. I don't need you to Karen explain everything to me. Where are we up to? Losing my mind. Quests is where we're going. Uh, carted away. The keys. I can't find all the keys all the time. Someone is caught. Oh, yes. Oh, I'm so excited for that. Successfully. Okay. Time to find enemies. Let's go find an enemy. Another time. Okay, we're gonna find an enemy. I think I saw some just over here. Oh. Why don't you come closer? Well, you're not gonna hurt me? Oh, I guess not. Yeah, I thought everyone here were wizards. Oh, well, that's all good. I'm only attacking him slowly because. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I also think someone's gonna actually hurt me. Damn it. Feel with them <laughs> selling their babies. I never got around to. Getting up to that. I never got up to that point. I was able to do it, but I was too busy focused on so many other things that I never did, really. I can imagine that would be... that does feel weird, though. You're a slippery little shrike, aren't you? Oh, the Oops! <laughs> I'm used to having Confringo on my, um, on my Y. It's crazy, I'm only 43% of the way done. Right? There is so much in this game! And I feel like, <laughs> I feel like you still barely scratched the surface. There we go, I'm hoping that's done something. Is that something I can collect? Ah, oh, I guess it would be. Whoops. There we go. Oh, whoops. Wrong button. Wrong button. Oh, again, wrong button. Oh, no. It did hurt. Yes, you would be right. Oh, goodness. There we go. You know what? We're just gonna bang, bang, just to get it over with. I don't know if that means the whole game or just the main story. I don't know. It's not the main story. It's the whole game, I think. Oh. Because I think on my Juliet Russo one, I finished. Um, I finished the story, but uh, the percentage is still there. Oh, that hurt! Oh no, I didn't mean to take two. Okay, it looks like I can't like dodge his attacks. Only Protego. Oh! Bang! 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 Make me dodge your attacks, please. Oh, where'd you go? Thank you. <laughs> I'm a professional at this game, I promise. 
Come on, where are you going? I can't get you over there. You mop it? Hello? <laughs> you can't get me! Oh, there we go. Oh, that was easy. I never use the jungle effect very often. Oh, juggle effect. I missed out so much damage because I just straight up deflect all their shots and then hit them with a power shot. No, that's fair enough. I I agree. There's especially when you're in in those um, dare I say team fights where um, where it's everyone against you and then they are. Uh, If my words could work, that would be awesome. Oh, I love these. That's so cool. I'm very easily impressed. English, please. Oh, yeah, when they're all on you and, and you're, you've like you've got your combos sorted and you're like, yeah, cool, I can do blah, 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 blah. And then you try and do that. Um, and then everyone's attacking you at once. All you can do is Protego <laughs> and stupefy them. <laughs> uh, it does kind of suck. Especially when you've got so much damage on you. So much that you could be doing. Oop. Hello. Can I dodge you? Hello. I'm scared of this one. Did that count? Oh my god, it counted. Hell yeah. Ooh! Trying to lick me? I just need one more dodge. Just one more dodge. One more dodge. Oh. One more dodge. One more dodge? Whoa. Okay. Now I can get rid of you. Fairly well. Thank you very much. Now I can go and attend defense against the dark arts. And yes, we're going to run the. Oh, what's over here? Oh, juices. On road again. I can't wait to get on road again. Whoa. There's a river here. Come on, Karen, you got this. There we go. Why is there a book here? Can I pick that up? No. Interesting. Okay. Okay. We're gonna run, see if we can find... Do these flowers annoy anyone else? I think they're so funny. A lot of other people are not impressed. But, you know, they're just boring. But that's not my problem. <laughs> Personal opinion. I never I never broom yet either. I keep trying to remember if I do or not, which I don't. I'm working up to it. Do I have a quest for it yet? No. I still want to find out what that last mount is too. I really hope it's a dragon. I'm still hopeful on it. I'll I'll forever be hopeful on it. I don't care if it isn't. <laughs> I'm still keen to find out. And I'm leaning way too far into the TV, into the TV, into the computer monitor. I have never been here before. This is new. Froggy, hi. How are you? Welcome, welcome. What, what, do you, what do you think of, what do you think of YouTube? What do you think uh <laughs> How's your week been going, Froggy? It's so lovely to see you here. Although I think it's getting to me because I was angry that I couldn't find something the other day and I shouted Rebellion. <laughs> I can imagine that happening too. <laughs> oh no. 
To be fair, I don't think you would be alone. I would like to say that I have done that myself. I cannot confirm <laughs> that I have though. Oh, oh, is it my favorite one? I love these guys. Ah, oh, it's the nice one. <laughs> They're so good. So good. Hello, Dr. Wolf, is that? How are you, Dr. Wolf? Lovely to see you here. Welcome in. My name is Peter, if you haven't met me before. I usually stream on Twitch, but I am going in between Twitch and YouTube at the moment. Seeing what this is all about. Have you played Hogwarts Legacy? And what house are you in? Most importantly. No discrimination here though. Just a bit of fun banter. You're <laughs> better, I guess. Do you like it, YouTube? Do you like it? Do you like Blair? English is also a really hard language for me. It is my first language. <laughs> Pressing the... Oh, I can access them from press R. Is still learning spells? Awesome. Yes, I like to wait in advance. How far along are you? I'm, I'm, this is my first YouTube live stream too, so bear with me if, <laughs> if I'm a little over the place, I'm trying to find, um, what's where <laughs> at the moment. I'm used to a very different setup for my Twitch, so yeah, that's all. <laughs> Do bear with me. Oh, that's new. Is that new? See a little speech bubble above her head? I started playing this, I got it, um, I got it early so that I could play it pre-release on stream. So there's a few things that I'm learning that's just a few little patches and whatnot that I've gone, oh, that's new. Really have to add a Patronus. I do too. If it's not already there, I do too. Professor, I wondered. And that'd be did so nice. I did. I You're am a Gryffindor? Of Ravenclaw House. Well, welcome in. I'm a Slytherin. I was curious <laughs> we have Ravenclaw in the chat. Changed over the years. <laughs> I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. It's lovely to have you here. I dare say more than the have you always been change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every <laughs> year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you. Trying to talk too much when they're talking. I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigella's flag for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. I, I hadn't realised that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Yes, Romeo is here. Oh, also, Wolf, I have a dog. He sits on my streams. His name is Romeo. <laughs> and he's well loved by a lot of people, I've noticed. But he's almost always here. Prince, you see, I was once wounded by time itself. Ooh. It's kind of weird. I know, I was thinking that too. This is all part of the adjustment that we're like, okay, we gotta work out what's happening here. <laughs> it's so different to Twitch, but it's okay. I'm enjoying it so far. I've only been live for got the hips. Not that long. <laughs> Can't even see where. Oh, there it is. Twenty-five minutes. I'm enjoying it so far. <laughs> it is weird without the emotes though. On Twitch, I've got all of my um, I've got all Hogwarts uh, emotes. So it's good fun. But yeah. Do you watch many streamers, Wolf? I was once wounded by time itself. What would Karen say? I'm also very much not a Karen. <laughs> I am probably the polar opposite of a Karen. Uh but I like playing a character here. I think it's fun, it makes it more interesting. And trying to think. I always have to try and get into her head of like how's it how do, how would she play things out? 
I think she'd be fascinated. Time itself. I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, oh, well. <laughs> Wolf, exactly. I took with my prior position. Here's my Romeo, I mean, it's Julian. not have heard that I wasn't unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, oh, I hope honest. I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. Yeah, yeah for now. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. No worries. Attend Wait, didn't I? Oh. I thought that was me attending. Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> I gotta leave the classroom and now I come back in? Got it. My favourite... student. Oh, I'm not sure who my favourite student is. As far as me and not a character, I... Hmm. I have to get back to you on that one. I'm actually going through them like Sebastian, Natty, Poppy, because we haven't met all of them yet in this... in this, um playthrough so I'm going back ominous uh, I <laughs> you're gonna hate me and I know you <laughs> I like ominous <laughs> but I'm a rule follower myself so you know we'd get along <laughs> I do watch twitch sometimes but I guess YouTube is better even for streamers to get community really twitch has hob hob terrible algorithm i guess yeah no i can understand that i guess to twitch i don't want to say it's oversaturated but it's it is difficult to sort of find your way through unless you climb up through a different way you know there's so many people on there and it's hard to sort of get seen and, and notice especially when you're a smaller streamer so yeah i can i can totally understand that <laughs> maddie i told you you'd hate me <laughs> I know you hate Ominous, but I like him. <laughs> he gave me really creepy vibes at the start, but I warmed up to him, I'll be honest. <laughs> I know Sebastian's your homeboy. You like Poppy? She is sweet. Poppy is sweet. I hope you were able to take care of everything I Professor, I, I completed I all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Do you stream then at all, Wolf? Or do you just sit and watch? Pay close attention. I have a lot of watches. The disarming charm and I'm always may curious. Be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Well, I am not focused, nor is my wand steady, but yet here we are. <laughs> Good work. The dummy is Thank here you. if you wish to stay in practice. Who are you calling a dummy? <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> In case anyone here is like, Expelliarmus. um, you seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save what your life. What is going on? Day. Fairly well. Now that I have learned this spell, I can go on with my quest. I also have this on. I think we're on low latency. Because I'm huge on community and getting to know people and chitty chatting and trying to keep that as close as possible. And I have to have it on low latency for that. Which kind of sucks in a way. I'm just curious, I can't see. It's not telling me. There you are. You don't tell Across me. one's do list to beat. Oh my goodness. Spooked me. That sounded like Sebastian. I know, it should be low latency. Anywho's, <laughs> I, hate to see I hope the lag isn't too much, is more where I was going with that. Have no business in Hogsmeade. Where are we going? To where do we go? To where does Karen want to lead us? Does she have any current quests that are of intrigue? Ah oh, yes, carted away. Yes, well, ah, oh, summoner's court, that's where I wanted to go. 
No lag? Amazing! The normal... Normal latency. So I have control over the latency, like, as far as... Um... How... Quick my reactions are to chat. <laughs> that sounds really weird. How about this one? Oh. Next one. Next one's my favourite one. I think it's hilarious. I think it's just totally over over the top. I don't see any lag. Huzzah! So I can have it low latency, which keeps the lag fairly short. And so I can be in more or less real time with you, similar to Twitch. But if I have it at normal latency, which allows me to stream at a higher... Um, higher quality, and I can get subtitles and other things, um, it's at least a 10 to 20 second delay between, you know, I, I see your chats pop up straight away and I try and respond almost straight away if I can, um, whereas you get like a 20 second delay. And to me it's annoying, but I don't know how much it actually bothers people when they're actually watching streams. So I've had it on low latency. I might put it up, to, sorry, I put on ultra low latency so that I can have it as close to real time as possible. So I might try low latency next time, just out of curiosity. I like the idea of having subtitles on. Game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent outside of- A real opponent? Charms class. All right, Leander. Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test mm. of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? Very well. I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Brilliant. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Akio. Are these the bouncy ones? I want him to test it for me. All in the rift. I'm not testing it. <laughs> I'm not brave enough to test this myself. I'm nervous. I was really good at these once upon a time. Oh, and it's the bouncy ones! Damn it! <gasps> oh, damn it! <laughs> what if I bounced your ball into one of the bouncy ones, huh? How'd you like it? How'd you get a spin on it? He's hacking. He's cheating. Nothing to it. I feel like Karen would call that guy a ginger. <laughs> And we should probably insult him if she doesn't win. Oh, no, no, no. I was meant to knock it off. <laughs> I just helped not him bad. win. Not bad. No. Okay. Yeah, not bad. I just made you win. You muppet. Let's see if I can knock off at least one, or, if not two that. of his balls. <sighs> I'm going to make him, like, win with full marks. I'm sensing it. No! <laughs> that was one for the ages. Well, we'll, we'll try that again. No, no, you didn't. We're doing this again. <laughs> you cheated. You young whippersnapper and your It's all in the wrist. Bet a few galleons on that round. Care to go again? Mm -hmm. Yes. I'm game for another we round. We must win. Grand. You could use the practice. These children. Oh, I could use the practice. Disgusting. The ever Disgusting. Go on, Leander. Okay, new tactic, new tactic. Mm. What tactic, what tactic do we use? All in the wrist. Now, this one I can get through pretty well, I do believe. Yeah. We're going to do it this way. Don't you frick! Okay. Okay. Oh, well, look, we're both off. Okay, it's fine. We're both off. We're both off. We're back to an even playing field. Okay, I can get you up to fifty. Nothing to it. Miss Blue. Come on. No, I want this one. Easy fifty. Nice. Go on, Leah. Don't. <laughs> I was so confident and I was waiting for it just to like, just tip over. <laughs> We're fine. We're fine. Okay. All right. Okay. Now if I can get you up to that. the 50. 
then we win. Let's see if there's a best a best way to go about this. Not there. We're gonna have to be we're gonna have to be uh, really careful about this one. Okay. All right. This could either go really well or really bad. Come on, Karen. What have we got for me? Nope, I messed it. I messed it up. I messed it up. Oh, I messed it up. I overshot it just a little bit. Just a little bit. Didn't think you were a match for me. Ah, Maddie, we were so close. We were so close. Dang it. I would have had that. I would have had that. <laughs> I was a little too far to the right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't rub it. What? I can't go again? Oh, yes, I can. I'm game for another round. <laughs> it always throws me off when you it's blacked out. You can do the practice. Me. Don't get cocky now, sir. Third time's a charm. Third time's a charm. Come on. This is the one. This is the one. I <laughs> feel. That's a good start for me. That's a good start for me. Uh, we want to get you on the end here. We're going to sneaky her through. Yeah. Ah, oh, look at that. I tied him twice that and beat him by one. Really? Wow. Oh, that is so impressive. Well done. <laughs> Why do you have to knock your ball right into one? Because now I've got to hit yours, right? Oh, unless I can maybe like knock yours out a bit more. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, far out. All right, fine, fine, fine. After this one, we'll, we won't do it again. I've seen worse. Not really the first time I tied him, you both ended into... Oh, <laughs> fair enough. I see. I see what's going on. Nothing to it. Oh, I wonder, can I sabotage him? I feel like Karen would sabotage, right? Oh, never mind. Did I win? Lucky shot. Well done. You beat me. <laughs> I just have to try sabotaging him and I win. I mean, you know, it just it happens, right? Bit of good luck. That's all. Ah. <laughs> uh... Ooh. I mean, I feel like can't be kind of cocky, right? That wasn't luck. No need to be upset. Hmm. <laughs> 200 IQ. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Just don't focus on winning and focus on sabotaging them and you win because you accidentally played right. <laughs> Flawless victory. Mm. That wasn't luck. I'm not lucky. I'm simply better than you. Ah, right, oh, good girl. You're right. You're better than me. <laughs> I lost twice, but we're not going to talk about that. Playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. <laughs> You're clearly not cut out for this. Leander, there's no easy way to say this. <laughs> what is well, better? Actually, I know, right? There is. You're not cut out for it. Well, you could oh. have found a harder way to say it. But perhaps you're right. I'll let the others know you're good enough for them. <laughs> As you should. Thank you very much. About time someone realized. <laughs> okay, where are we actually going? I feel like there's other side quests and stuff I need to pick up on. Let's go finish here. And we're going to teleport. World map. We're going to come over here. We're going to travel. No worries, Froggy. Thank you so much for hopping around. Hopping around. That was an accident. <laughs> Frog hop. I'm hilarious. Thank you so much for, for being here. I hope you have a wonderful evening if I don't see you again. Ah, oh, my goodness. I do have another question for those that are playing Hogwarts Legacy. Do you pick up every single... Um... Oh, hello guys. Can we be friends? Oh, I want to be friends. <laughs> Until next time. <laughs> 
Hop to it, Froggy. Thanks for hopping in. Um, I think my game's a little glitched. My question was, to those that play Hogwarts Legacy, do you pick up every ingredient that you come by? Come by? Like if you come past like toadstools or leeches or anything else? Do you pick everything up? Here I am, as good as my word. As good as your word, hey? What is going on? Oh, I need to close this. For those that know me, um, I don't... Um, always turn off my evening alarm. Whenever I stream, so it always goes off. 100% so much that I max out all the stuff I can grab. Do you? I was watching if there was a max. I thought that there was a max and I saw other people just collecting everything as they went along. Oddly enough, or not oddly enough, funnily enough, it was another Ravenclaw player. <laughs> She's naturally a Ravenclaw as well. And she was also picking everything up as she went. Spooky. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It <laughs> would take the patience of a Hufflepuff to track down these pages. Well said. Heck yeah. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep That's your eyes enough. open for a bird bath. When you a find it, bath. say intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I, think Latin. I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? <laughs> I max up my potions all the time by accident. Ah! Oh, I know there's a max on potions. Aside I didn't even know there was a max. Bath. Anything else I should look for? Where Indeed. earth did the... A oh, there he is. Marks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and a Thank lake. You. Stone bridge, waterfall, lake. I get really suspicious vibes from Jackdaw, personally. Rather unfortunately coming back to me. You only have 25 green potions? Really? Hmm. Yes. Well, that's actually you know, really good to know. The closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply no worries, Jackdaw. Oh. Adieu, you say. Oh, I hate spiders. Why couldn't we follow the butterflies? There we are. Lovely, delightful. Oh! Okay, you're gonna have to bear with me because these are the big scary spiders. Oh! Wait, wait, that's not what I wanted. Oh my god, that's great though. Okay. Ah! I don't- I was trying to- Uh oh. That's what I wanted. I was trying to do this on you before, not your little... F friends? I was gonna say allies or- Is that a person? been us when you start picking up potions once you get 25 it will tell you can't pick up anymore oh the game does have an arachnophobia i i remember hearing about that it's okay i have played this game already i am used to it enough <laughs> it still spooks me I got scared the first time i set a spider on fire and it screamed <laughs> i hate it I hate that so much. <laughs> That's horrible. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Oh, it's so pretty here, though. Why can't we do this in the daytime? How gorgeous is it over here? We're gonna go exploring on our way. 
because there's something here that we can collect, I suppose. We can go diving. Oh, I got a light sun hatch. Wonderful. Not that I need it. Oh, maybe I do. Does Karen need a light sun hatch? Perhaps. Oh, what is here? Cute. Looks like a nice little picnic over here. <laughs> over there. Oh, that's uh, very specific. That's where I'm going. This area is considered dangerous by the Ministry of Magic. To be fair, this is very against Karen's will. Or would Karen be investigating this? So she has more receipts to take back to the Ministry to say how dare they let children enter the Forbidden Forest when it is forbidden and there are rules around it. Maybe this is all... Collecting evidence. Because <laughs> they're quite rule followers, right? About this, place. this is really pretty. Such regal creatures, stags. I'm loving this. I don't think you go this way for Slytherin. I could be wrong, but I don't remember it being this pretty. Maybe it was, and I'm just... I'm just forgetful. It's so gorgeous here, though. Oh, another one. Oh, no, okay, this is the same way that you go there for Slytherin. Just as Jackdaw described. I only remember the bird bath. I really wish they would add some more of the ones from the movie. Like... Ah, oh, Hagrid's wand. Yeah. I... Okay, there's an easter egg that I saw on Instagram that's in Hogwarts Legacy, which is a tribute to the actor of Hagrid, which I always forget his name. But there's a tribute to him, but it's not next to Hagrid's hut. You've got to fly some way further, a little bit further away and up a mountain, sort of hidden somewhere. Which... I thought that kind of sucked. <laughs> I was hoping it'd be something... Robbie! Thank you! I don't know why I always forget his name. But... Yeah. I don't know why he put, wouldn't put the tribute next the to tribute Hagrid's hut. Instead of somewhere away that you have to fly to. Oh, well, you can run to it, but... Ooh, we've got a portal. Oh, and we have friends. Aren't you a little far from home? Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Do ah. bear with me whilst I try and finish this off. Hurt you. Hurt you as well. Do bear with me. Oh! Got them both. Heck yeah. Incredible. That was so easy, yes? I think it would be cool to have an umbrella wand. Yes! No, I agree. I think that'd be really cool. Or like something you can sort of upgrade into, maybe? Maybe something cool and unique where it's like you have now earned this or like thank you for saving Hogwarts or something. I don't know. <laughs> Somewhere at the end of the game, at the end of the story where they go, you know, thank you so much for blah, blah, blah. Why was that Azkaban? Why you do this to me? Are we going back there? That was creepy. how big this place is. Lego! Class is in session! Hello, my dear! How are you? Oh, everyone's hopping in. I love you guys. Thank you for saying hi and hopping hopping in. Oh! Oh, there we go. I need to attack it. Got it. Got it, got it. Hmm. These runes must have something to do with opening this door. 
Wow, Karen, you're so smart, you Muppet. My inner raven claw was tingling. <laughs> so many raven claws here tonight. We had a Gryffindor in here earlier too, if they're still around. Well, here's a stone bridge. As suggested by Jackdaw. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. Revelio. Haven't used this at all yet in this session, so we must use it at least once, right? We'll collect that. Anything else to collect? Oh, I wonder if any I of these spiders. spiders Quince, you're here too. There's a quick drop. In is something happening or going to? What? Oh. No worries, Quince. I hope you're having a wonderful week. This makes me so happy seeing you guys all here. <laughs> Maddie's been hanging out for ages. Froggy hopped in. Karen, I hear you. I'm having a chitty chatty with my wonderful community that I love and appreciate so much. Okay, gosh. <laughs> so lovely. Okay, <laughs> the eagles are coming. Yes, the eagles are coming. I'm wonderful. Thank you, Quince. How is your day going? I'm actually really enjoying YouTube so far. I mean, it's just different. There's different things that are set up. Also, I did find out that if I um, plan for a stream. So if I, if I schedule a stream, it'll come up on my page as though with a thumbnail and everything, though I'm... As though I'm live, I guess. So I'm going to have to look at that again. Just because I... <laughs> Poor Maddie. <laughs> I was setting things up when I was managing or, you know, setting up a broadcast or something. And the way that I... All right. Karen, shush. We're talking. <laughs> we... <laughs> um... Streams become videos as well. Yes. That's the other thing. I was... Curious to try and make YouTube my one-stop shop for everything Peter Tiffany streaming related. <laughs> we let anybody in, right? <laughs> um. My brain stopped again. <laughs> I know, like, I know. It's a risk I'm willing to take because I want to have a quick chat to you guys because I forgot what I was talking about. So it doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> um, talking about streaming. I don't know. I don't remember. I'm glad to see you all here. It's really nice. You made a kilo of mac and cheese. Is it good? Are you going to share with me? I may die. <laughs> Some of you may die. <laughs> But that is a sacrifice I'm willing to make. <laughs> which is fair enough, Lego, which is fair enough. I mean, as long as it tastes good, right? That's the most important part. In my humblest of opinions. Ah! I'm anxious and nervous and I cannot pay a lot of attention to you all at the moment. Oh, you're an easy one. Haha. -ha. Oh my golly, I was not meant to do that then. Bang, bang, bang. Actually, I'm curious what the arachnophobia um, thingy looks like. Hey, there we go, level up. Ooh, use Gruyere. Very posh. I don't think I've ever had Gruyere cheese. Gruyere. Yo! Welcome back, Wolf. Lovely to have you here. Welcome back. Leave you alone for 10 minutes and the walls descend. Not going to right? touch those. <laughs> My thoughts exactly. Oh! Oh, that was a hint. Did you get that? Did you pick that up? Did you pick up on that hint? This was the hint. That was the hint. Which, you know, is valid. I'm gonna nip the thunderbox. No, all good. Your video when you was running. Did you like it? Yay! 
So I'm going to be doing a whole series on my YouTube channel with that. I'm actually really happy that you are liking it. Because we're going to be getting more. I'm nervous. Oh, I shouldn't even be here. What am I doing here? <laughs> oh, I guess there's a chest on the other side. Do I still do it? Is it worth it? It better be worth it. If it's not worth it, I'm going to be so upset. But yeah, Quint, so Ripper Renos is what I've called our fake company. Our, meaning mine. Oops, wrong button. Ah, oh, thank goodness. I was waiting for it to be, your slots are all full, so you can't even pick this up. Uh, yes, yeah, so that's going to be our Ripper, Ren Ripper Renos series. Um, where I've made up a company. I've also made up a logo for them. It is completely fake. I did look up online just in case there was already a company called Ripper Renos. <laughs> because I was worried I was going to get in trouble. Uh, but I can't find any other company called it. Um, for those that aren't Australian, Ripper in Aussie slang generally means something that's really, really good. <gasps> run, 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 do bear with me, chat. I will chat to you in just a second. <laughs> so, as I was saying, uh, <laughs> shifting things around, evil. But <laughs> well, you know, if you're not going to be nice to me, I'm not going to be nice to you in my own petty sort of way. There's only so much I can do in that game. But I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to be doing some more. I've got one that I'm editing at the moment. And I was talking about in, um, on stream on Tuesday on Twitch, wondering if I should edit those videos like a... <laughs> Why? <laughs> Leave me alone. Ah, stupid. Ah, so rude. Do bear with me, chat, whilst I continue to obliterate these things. Oh! Oh, there's he. Another puzzle. Hmm. Ripper Renos! <laughs> it's going to be a whole series! So, um... Renos is just short for renovations. It's a really fun game. I really enjoy it. It's a really chilled out game. But I was asking, should I edit it YouTube like? So have it, you know, fast cuts, hard cuts, music on the top, sound effects, blah, blah, blah. Not too over the top because it's not me and my character to be like that anyway. Um, but a little more interesting to watch. And should I make a second playlist where um, I just play the game with no voice, no actually... <laughs> <laughs> the one that I recorded that I'm editing now asks the exact same question, so you're more than welcome to comment on that one when it's released. But it's going to be released every Monday, I think I've got it for. At the moment. Okay, I can't use that yet. When can I use it? 17. What level are we now? 16. Oh, yeah, almost there. Um, but yeah. Playing with things at the moment. <laughs> I don't think Karen is nice anyway, otherwise I should be named something else. This is true! This is true! This is very true. Hey, you that bigger- I know! That cabinet- <laughs> I was thinking that while I was watching it back not too long ago. I think I was watching it back earlier today. And I went... That doesn't feel... There it is. It feels, um, way too easy to be moving cabinets that, that big. Remarkable. You like how I edited it? Awesome. Good for easy going. Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm not, you know, I'm not like, hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be blah, blah, blah. And then like, you know, zoom in and all these fancy colors and whatnot. It, you guys know me. That's not my style. And I don't want to, I don't want to edit and perform that way in a YouTube video just for people to hop into my streams and notice that I'm this you know when they're wanting hey guys what's going on blah, blah, blah. 
You know what I mean? So I'm like, I want to try and keep it as true to me as possible. We shifted things around in real life. <laughs> Fire up. It is very challenging. It is. That game is so deceptive. Which way do I go? I'm so nervous. There's so many spiders. <laughs> I don't like turning the corner and seeing a dead one right next to me. They're huge. Uh, super real actually watching you play. Oh, yay. Okay. I think I might, I think I might start posting both because I do have the other one where it's just gameplay, no voice, no camera, no nothing. Just gameplay, game music. I've got that as well, so I might. And that one is very smooth. Um, because I, I know what I'm looking for. I know how to do the room, I guess. So. I think I'll post both. Which means then you get two videos a week instead of one. And if you, you know, you can choose which one you want to watch. If you want to watch both, you can watch both. You can watch this one. Oh, it's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. <laughs> this is true, but what he faced may have been worse, Karen. But that's fine. I'm on New Japan. Ooh, what sort of ideas, Quince? Do tell, do tell. Share with the class what you are thinking. I reckon your motorsport stuff would do really well. But I, yeah. There are people like me that don't know anything about it. Sight, but I may as well help myself to this. That was a little delayed, my dear, but okay, no drama. <laughs> What's over here? Is there anything at all? Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. We've got some on there, yay! I've got to subscribe to you. Not that I really checked to be fair. <gasps> I'm not going there. <laughs> I don't care how. Oh, what if it's a really good prize though? What if it's something that's really good? <sighs> I feel like I feel like I need to. All right, Touched guys, we're gonna. Chapter wasn't very thorough in his search of this case. <sighs> I did think about doing a video, having a happy. Yeah, no, that'd be good. Oh, you know what I like to see? I like to see people going through their car. Not through their car, but I, I like to learn about cars because I don't know a lot about cars. And just general knowledge is really useful. Oh, it'd be cool as like a mini series. I'm talking in series a lot these days <laughs> when it comes to YouTube. Because I think of them as, as series. You know, you put them in your own little playlist that you make on, on your channel. Um... But if you can have one where you don't have to like dress up or like play as a dad, but you know, like the idea of, you know, teaching people how to fill up their tires with air, teaching people how to, you know, having like, um, you know, how to change the windshield, windshield, windscreen, wiper, fluid cleaner stuff, how to check your own oil, like just stuff that you can do by yourself that doesn't need a lot of, you know, which is probably common knowledge to you, but a lot of people just don't know about it. And I didn't know about it for a very long time until I forced my father to teach me. Oh my god, look at all these eggs. Oh, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous. Huh? Ow! Okay, that hurts. Good to know. Can I get this one? I can. Oh, okay, that's too close. Good to know. My first video is on YouTube. What about Call of Duty Mobile and this so cringe? The phone TikTok is way better. Yeah. <laughs> I love you like, hey, I've got this. It's real cringe, but hey, it's there. How far does it? Oh, okay. So it does actually go quite far. Oh, but I heal. I heal when I'm covered. I didn't realize that I heal. Okay. Oh, that was far enough. Okay, alright. Maybe I do have a bit of range on it. I don't know how much range I've got. That was like three or four years ago when they came. Oh, okay. Oh, I see, I see. 
It's just that looking back on yourself and going, oh, really? I did that? Oh. What was I thinking? We're getting better. We're can I go invisible again, please? Thank you. Aha! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! What's in that? Why is it burning longer? <gasps> that makes me so uncomfortable! I'm so uncomfortable seeing that. Oh! I'm not here! I'm not here! Oh no! <laughs> I'm so dead. <laughs> Oh, or not. Maybe they've forgotten about me. Never mind, we're good, we're fine, it's fine, it's fine. The problem I find, I do a recording, then I play back, and I'm like, ill. <laughs> so much so I used to text a speech for my warning intro part. Really? That's okay. You know, there's a lot of people that don't use their voice, and that's completely fine. You can easily use your text to speech. That's completely fine. Or you can get someone else to read it out for you. If you want to do voiceover type stuff. Someone that, if you like their voice or something, ask a friend or a family member to help you out. I'm used to hearing my voice from acting and whatnot, so I'm so desensitized to it. <laughs> and I've disconnected myself. I find if I disconnect myself from what I'm hearing or seeing, and I don't watch it as though I'm watching me or I'm listening to me, I find that helps me a lot as far as getting used to hearing my voice and the more you edit and the more you film the more you'll get used to hearing your voice as well which I find helpful I thought about removing them but it's kind of hilarious I think it's I think it's nice to keep those old videos and things on I mean there are photos that I've got on some of my social media platforms that I've just gone do I still need them there not really but I kind of want to keep it do I need to be here I don't know Oh. I don't really want to use that on that. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh, that was easy. Okay, I was a lot more worried. If you heard me, you understand why. <laughs> You'll get used to it, I promise. I promise. I used to hate the sound of my voice. It made me feel sick. I heard it and I cringed and I wanted to turn it off and throw something at the screen and I refused to ever, ever, ever listen to my voice. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested but in this loot. But the more I edited no and the more that I did film stuff and whatnot, it forced me to listen to my voice over and over again through a recording, which is the worst way to listen to your voice. <laughs> I don't know if that was really worth it. I got a scarf from it, I guess. But it it takes time, I promise. I hear it took me a year and a half to two years to show my face on two. See, exactly. It takes a while. Welcome back, Lego. My so <laughs> That's fine. And if worse comes to worse, if you're really insecure about it, you can always use a bit of a voice changer. I'm just, I'm just saying. I've heard some people use voice changers, and they're very convincing. Very convincing. There's a girl that I've noticed on... Can I? No. Watching on, um... She keeps her up on my shorts. Oh. Do bear with me whilst I demolish these real quick. Forgot her name. I need to find it. But she has a really convincing voice changer. And she... Um, she makes herself sound like a guy and it's really, really convincing. So I would highly recommend having a look into that, if that's your biggest insecurity. Thank you very much. One of my favorite content creators is a voice changer. There you go! There's a lot of people that are insecure about their voices. And to people that use it for comedy as well. He's a scam. <gasps> Is that Kip Boga? I'm just, I'm just, just throwing it out there. I love Kip Boga. He's hilarious. Yeah, Lovelo. Yes, 
That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, her. It's a very convincing guy voice. If I closed my eyes, I'd be like, that's a dude. Same with the other guy that um, uses a child voice changer. I don't know his name, but I saw he did a few collabs with Lay. I'm glad Richard Jack Not Kip Berg, another one called me, but where could he be? Scammer Payback. Oh, interesting. I do not know this one. You have piqued mine interest. I want to post more me. So if you like me, great. If you don't... Quince, that is the right way to be. Because you're going to find people that do. You know, I started streaming and I was like, I don't know if you like me, you like me. If you don't, you don't. And then I've got... <laughs> and then I grow a community and then I've got... Like everyone here in chat and everyone else that follows me. You know, I stream at really weird times for a lot of people. And... You know, some people just fall in love with you and some people look at you and go, why are you even trying? <laughs> 200 IQ, how do I always know what you're talking about? <laughs> right? We're on the same wavelength. I'll put a couple of his in Discord. Yeah, okay, no, go for it. No, that'd be awesome. Thanks, Lego. Then I turned up and charged you out from the rooftops. Exactly. Everything within Tempest. Were you with Tempest? I don't know. I keep putting you guys together. I don't know why. But he found me first and then he just passed me on to or introduced me to so insult. many other people Tempest in his community. And I just blew up from there. Temp and Staffy. Yes. Temp found me first and then he started introducing me to other people. Then they introduced me to other people. And then they introduced me to other, me to other people. Minnie introduced me to Judo, and then Judo introduced me to Becca, and then it just went on from there. Uh, it, it's it's wonderful. I, re I really like those communities on Twitch. They're so, so sweet. And it just makes me so happy. We love Minnie. I love Minnie. She's so sweet. We've actually... <laughs> it's been... How long have I been streaming? Or how long has she known me? It's been at least a year and a half. It's, it's been a year and a half and we've been promising each other that we're going to do a Star G stream together. <laughs> Still hasn't happened. It's hard with time zones too and all that, but you know. I think my skydive video is still on my channel. Or ledge bungee. Bungee jumping? No thank you. Skydiving? Yikes. <laughs> a little video that's got my voice. All right. I'm supposed to be meeting up soon for- Oh! <gasps> no way, Lego! I'll tell them I say hi. I think they're public. Awesome, Quince. Thank you for letting us know. I keep meaning to join your Discord, but I always forget about it. <laughs> it's probably because I get sleep deprived. Which is totally fine, Maddie. Discord I tend to use for two different reasons. So I'm not one that actually uses Discord very much. It was more my community would hop on and be like, Do you have a Discord? Do you have a Discord? Where's your Discord? Can I join your Discord? And I went, I don't have a Discord. I have a Discord account, but I don't have a server for streaming or anything. I didn't know it was a thing. So, because enough people asked and I'm a pushover. <laughs> no, it's a lie. <laughs> so, I don't, I, point is, I don't use it very often. I use it more to make announcements and every now and again I'll check in. But the whole community is so active on it. Ku is constantly posting memes, which is so fun. I love being able to just jump in and seeing what Ku's posted. Lego is also very active, especially in the writing channel. Um, yeah, there's lots going on. I'm just personally myself not the most active on it, which is a little ironic. <laughs> Oops. I think people join and they go, cool, I got to hang out with Peter more. And I'm like, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, it's not. It doesn't work. I'm naturally quite introverted, so I just... Yeah, it's unintentional. I'm not ignoring anyone, I promise. I do try and hop on as often as I can. Oh, thank you, Lego. My mistake about the promo, but... Goodish news? Go. <laughs> Damn, Lego knows my secrets. <laughs> I use it very much. Yeah, I don't use it very often. I I do do my announcements in there, and I'm trying to be more active as far as, um, at least posting once a week. I'm trying. Lego can confirm I don't, but I'm trying. 
I'm trying to post at least once a week to check in on how everyone's going and whatnot because I think it'd be nice to have... Was she wearing a hat before? Nah, hat's gonna ruin her hair. Poor thing. Me. But, um, yes. Untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Yeah, so I'm, I'm trying to be a bit more active. At least once a week. I think that's enough. I've been... Okay, the other thing is that I go into other people's... Other streamers' discords too. I'm a part of a few other ones. And it just... To me, it feels really overwhelming. Especially if you're in so many discords. And everyone, every single day goes, Hey everyone, hey everyone, hey everyone. Hey at Madhouse, hey at Crazies, whatever the community is called. And just every morning I wake up and my phone is filled with notifications and it's all just, hey everyone, hope you're having a great day. And I'm like, uh. <laughs> and I don't want to mute the channel either in case I miss something, you know? So then I'm in this weird... So I, I try not to do too much of that in mine. And I only at everyone if I... um if I actually have an announcement and I only posted an announcements. I think some people have muted my other channels within the server, which is why in announcements, I usually ask, do you need me to post? Oh, I just realized. <laughs> I don't think I posted that I was going live. I lied to everyone. I lied to everyone. No. <laughs> okay, we're fixing this right now. <laughs> I've been live for over an hour. <laughs> I'm a failure. I'm a failure. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, let me find... <laughs> let me find... <laughs> oh no. It's gonna be music. Okay, let me... Oops, the daisies. <laughs> oh no. Most people do follow me on Instagram as well, but... I was meant to post it in Discord that I was going live. <laughs> I'll catch up on chat in just a sec. Oh, if I can spell Karen too, that'd be great. <laughs> what am I fixing? Um, so in my Discord earlier today, I... Um... I'm such a failure. I'm such a failure. Um, in my Discord earlier today, in my announcements channel, I said, hey everyone, we're having, we're doing our first YouTube live tonight, blah, blah, blah. Um, I'll announce it in this channel when I go live. And we've been live for an hour and I have totally forgot to announce it in my Discord. I put it on Twitter and my Instagram as I normally do with Twitch. Um, Good night, twins. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you have a wonderful evening and I hope everything's okay and I hope you are well. And that everything is going okay. I had to move my chair because it was a bit. Um... But yes. Oh, also, Dr. Wolf, thank you so much for the sub. <laughs> I didn't get a notification. Why was there no notification? Excuse you. I'm so sad. I was supposed to get one. I also haven't set this up with the same alerts that I normally do, but... Yes, Maddie, I'm saying I epically failed. I told everyone that I was going to announce when I went live, and I didn't because Twitch is automatically synced to my Discord, so when I go live on Twitch, it automatically alerts everyone. Uh, ha however, it did not do so today because it is YouTube, not Twitch. And I was going to announce it in the same channel where my Twitch goes. <sighs> I've announced it now. So if anyone hops in, <laughs> we know where they've come from. <laughs> oh, what did I miss? That's why I disabled. Yeah, yeah. 
no, yeah, there's a lot of notifications that come through Discord. Hockey. <laughs> oh, hockey season's over. Oh. Everyone has first time. Well, exactly. This is the first time I've ever streamed on YouTube. So I was expecting hiccups. And I am not disappointed. Well, I'm disappointed. But for other reasons. <laughs> You're all amazing and thanks for your kindness and patience. All the time, Quince. I hope you have a beautiful night. It was really nice to see you here. Thank you so much for hopping in. Ah. Really appreciate it. Where do I go? Oh. Oh. Okay, well I guess we go here and we... Oh, I can't move you over there now. Rude. Rude. But I just want to jump over, please. Oh, I need to go on the other side, I think. I think there's a bit here. Whoops. Here we go. This is where I was going. Let's see. Can I make it? Oh, I freaking hope so. Let's go! Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that. I'm amazing. I'm amazing. <laughs> Some of these caves are super tricky. Yeah. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot. That's odd. Blah, 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 blah. Spiders. Why couldn't we follow butterflies? <laughs> Sweet dreams, Quince. Mwah. Thank you so much for hopping in. Actually, let us change our gear. I think Karen needs new gear. We don't want to ruin her beautiful blouse. I wonder. I wonder. Oh, no, she doesn't have any white gloves yet. Damn. Damn. That's alright. Just fine. Just fine. Now, I do believe I need to jump off and go around there, but what was the point of getting on here then? Am I crazy? Probably. Whoops! I'm oh, fine, I feel great. <laughs> what news, Lego? <laughs> How dare you shout at me. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You know I'm kidding. You're lucky I'm not Karen. Ha 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 ha. You're the top 300 monks in the EU region. Hey! Congratulations, that's excellent. That's amazing, Lego. Well done. You're gonna be mean if you tried. Is that a challenge? Temper, temper. I wouldn't dream of challenging you. Pity. Why not? And as far as brains go, I've got the lion's share, but when it comes to brute strength, I guess I'm in the shallow end of the dream pool. Uh, there's one in every family, sire. Two in mine, actually. And they always seem to ruin special occasions. Hmm, what am I going to do with him? I'm like a very handsome Truro, Sazu. And just think, whenever he gets dirty, you can take him out and beat him. <laughs> Fun little fact about me is that is a quote that I quote far too often. <laughs> And once I get started with a movie quote, I have to finish it. Never, Lego, you've got to make me. You have too nice of a soul to be mean. Oh, thank you. Jeremy Irons. Oh, yes. I don't know, Lego. She hasn't read the book. No! <laughs> I will read them, I promise. <laughs> I feel attacked. Where on earth am I meant to be going? Oh my god. <laughs> oh no, you have to come to Australia. Oh no. Oh no. How horrible. <laughs> Making nice. Oh, I don't like shrimp. I mean, you can try. We also don't have shrimp. 
in Australia. We have prawns. We don't have shrimp. Hey, Alex, how are you going? So this is YouTube. I I suppose it is, yeah. So so it seems to be the case. I think I meant to go this way. I feel like I just came from this way. But maybe I go this way and then I go around and down. Yes, maybe. Oh, ouch, okay. I was expecting that to be a little deeper. Oh. The bridge. It's almost complete. Exactly where I was going. Oh, more spiders. Okay. Hold on a sec, guys. I was just about to help hang out and chitty chat with chat, but um it seems as though the game has different ideas for me. Ah! Do you bear with me or... Okay, now we're good. What are we up to? <laughs> I'm gonna keep bringing it up. Until you read them. <laughs> That's fair enough. That is fair enough. Oh, it's a big scary one. <gasps> oh, I'm scared. Anyone else terrified? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was spooky! I'm not happy! I just saw he was coming in! Ah! Oh! Yeah, I like that one! Did I just get rid of him? What the? Oh! <laughs> Let me just open the door and scare <laughs> This is very slow opening of my door. <laughs> there was no one standing there. <laughs> I need to find out which genies decided, you know, our convicts. We should leave them here. Also, I'm into an island with great, amazing weather. Well, you know, <laughs> the weather's not great. <laughs> Books greater than films. It's not even close. I've heard. I've heard. I will read them. I promise. I'm going to even prove to you that I will read them by making them an audiobook so then you can hold me accountable. Okay, Maddie? Okay, you happy? Ah, <laughs> uh, how's work going, Alex? Are you having a great old time? Is it super duper exciting? You poor thing. And so we turn to the cricket. You all live in a pill. Oh! Fair enough. That makes sense. Okay. See, a lot of things go over my head. I suppose that shall suffice for now. I am appeased, but that could change given the amount of time it will take you. This is true. This is true. <laughs> I'll use my whole weekend. I'll use the whole weekend before I start my first shift. On my first shift, it's not shift work. My first day at my new job on Monday. <laughs> I'll make sure I get exceptionally exhausted. Not a headless skeleton in sight. And absolutely have to, um, to so that I can read all. Oh, am I including The Cursed Child? Because I have read that, and I, I loved that book. I thought it was really good. That's why so many Aussies come back here to work. Returning to the scene of the crime. <laughs> so you think we're there because we like you. <laughs> no, no, no. We're there for revenge. Ah, oh, this game is so pretty! It's so pretty, it's so... I freaking love it. I love how cinematic it is, you know? It looks like a movie. Like, those little, like... And look, you'll see the floor here. I'm pretty sure this floor does it. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, it does! See, it's got that, like, water underneath it. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's so pretty. I love it. I love it so much. Yeah, Maddie, am I including the eighth book? I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains. And those pages. 
Oh, I see knights up ahead. Anyone else see knights up ahead? Let me just double check my clothing. Make sure I'm all up to date. We have nothing new. We have nothing new. I thought we had something new. I guess we have nothing new. We have nothing new. <laughs> I'm half asleep. What is that? Oh, tongues. Delicious. Has anyone eaten tongue? I haven't. I don't want to. <laughs> I'm just curious if you have and what your idea of it was. How would you rate eating tongues? Oh, these are all our enemies that we faced. We can now see everything about them. Let me guess. You don't like fire? Oh, striking it with a fire spell as it prepares to attack with acidic venom will ignite the spider. The more you know. Not necessarily the original seven will work. We can tackle the eighth one later. Okay. I have read the eighth one and I really, really, I loved it. Cow, ox, and bison. Really? Really tender when cooked, right? Would you eat it again? I, it makes my tongue feel so uncomfortable talking about this. I was deceived into eating tongue and I was angry when I found out. I was deceived into eating liver. Multiple occasions. Although they tried to make it nice to me. They tried to schnitzel it. Which is nice. Nice of them to do. Maybe we should read through these at some point. Ox tongue is good. Yeah. And welcome back, Alex. Of course, yeah. <laughs> I have. You'd eat it again with onions and gravy? You've eaten heart? <laughs> I should stop asking these questions because all my organs start going funny. <laughs> they just stop, like, feeling there. <laughs> of course you'd read I've seen all the movies, so then I had the eighth one and I was reading it on the bus to and from uni at the time. I hadn't seen anything on it again, yet. Richard Thank you for keeping <laughs> and it was good, and I years. liked it too. I think a few people didn't like the book very much because it was written in play style, but I I liked it. But I've read a lot of plays, so it was use, I was used to it. You've had cow brain too? Yuck, I can't. I really can't. <laughs> I want to be so accepting of you. I want to be like, wow, that's really interesting. Tell me more. But I really, I can't even pretend with this one. <laughs> it's so gross. Did you enjoy them though? <laughs> Your grandma did the liver trick? Uh, uh. So rude. So rude! Here it is. The map that brought your doom. It all sounds super gross. It does. Mm. I can't even is pretend. Something beyond this room? I'm trying to read this. I knew you guys just want to come and fight. So rude. Oh, can I disarm? I wonder. Bing, bang, boom. Bing, bang, boom. I want you in my room. Amigo. Heart was a bit tough. Brain was vile. I can't imagine it. Being good. You know, I used to love land brains, really. Yuck. I don't get it. I just, I'd first, I didn't get it. How do we devolve into such conversations? I don't know. Welcome to my streams. <laughs> Where? Whoop. It, it goes into it. Actually, how did we get here? I'm curious now. Oh, I know, because we I saw I had a tongue ingredient on my thingy. That would do it. See how I dodge into the character? I'm learning for Dark Souls. Because <laughs> we all know that's where, that's where this is going to end up, right? No? <laughs> I'm in the chat. That is also true. Like it was supposed to be in the same wavelength. <laughs> 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 
Uh, I can't help but laugh at those. <laughs> I was like, oh, chaotic evil Ravenclaw. That is, that's a, that's a dangerous combo. That is dangerous. The restricted section. You did. Good job, Karen. You're so smart. Wait, Ravenclaws? Oh no. Yes, Alex, we have Ravenclaws in chat. What are you, Alex? Do you know? I'm curious. Am I the only Hufflepuff? Oh. <laughs> Meanwhile, playing a mean, evil Hufflepuff. Are you a Karen Hufflepuff? <laughs> Secretly? I would also, yes. I would say yes. Hi, I'm a Slytherin. <laughs> Although I'm in, I'm in between. I don't know. Every time I do... Um... The quizzes and whatnot. I'm always between Ravenclaw and, and Slytherin. Ask my necromancer who sacrificed nothing but newborns in D&D. Excuse me. <laughs> you what? I'm gonna Aquarius. Oh, so natural chaotic, but come on. <laughs> yeah, Aquarius. Aquarius can be quite on the chaotic side. Oh, here we go. Where am I? Great question, Karen. Are you saying you don't know? The room <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> I should give you the control then, Alex. You should. What sort of magic is this? What is going on? Oh, we're marbles. <laughs> Are we a gobstone? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. I hope so too, for your sake, Karen. Oh, you're between Hufflepuff and Slytherin. Oh, such an interesting mix. Mostly Hufflepuff. Oh, you and your loyalty. Ah. <laughs> <I'm> so naive. No kidding. <laughs> you are strong, though. I think Hufflepuff's uh, such an underrated, underrated, um... It's a class. It's not a class. House. My necromancer became powerful by realizing sacrificing newborns to the darkness gave the most potency. Oh my goodness. To be fair, I think a necromancer would probably go down. Especially chaotic evil. What is this place? That feels right, right on par. Hey! Where are we? Your best friend's a Hufflepuff? Oh, I have a hero complex. So you would think I'd be Griffin. Griffin dork. <laughs> no, I'm a Ravenclaw. Yeah, there's a few things where I go, oh, you're really loyal and you're really courageous and they're a Hufflepuff. And I go, Hufflepuffs are also loyal and courageous. Hold on. <laughs> there are a lot of things that are, that are very similar, but it, I guess it goes down, it goes deeper than that. I'm always really curious to know. I feel like Hogwarts houses are like uh, horoscopes for geeks. <laughs> Ooh. What is this? Thank you, Jackdaw. Hello, Can sir. It be? I don't know. Oh, is that all? Okay. Speak to the portrait. Such a pretty room, though. Everything about this game is so gorgeous. Look at that. Ah, oh, it's beautiful. I love it so much. Yes, Matty. Yes, I did. I think it covers more of the general general public that that go with um hogwarts houses and and things like that as more of a not a religion that sounds bad more as a i can't even get my words today <laughs> lego you know me too well i might have to do something about that hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. All my life I thought it was a Hufflepuff. I'm telling you that now. I was convinced that I was a Hufflepuff. <laughs> you have a rising Hufflepuff? Wow. <laughs> what would be your moon? What's your sun? <laughs> like I... <laughs> I mean, what? Hmm? <clears throat> Sorry, my bad. Ugh. Did I? Ugh. <clears throat> <laughs> you know, if if my if my Hogwarts houses were my astrology, I think I would have. I reckon I'd have a Hufflepuff rising, with like a Ravenclaw. Um, I reckon I have a Ravenclaw moon and a Slytherin sun. I think that's how I'd probably go. You probably are. I mean, you seem like. See, I always, I always thought that I was, and then I was talking to someone. <laughs> we we're on the conversation anyway, and then we moved on to something else, and I started talking about, you know, oh, I've got this friend. She thinks we're friends, but we're not actually friends. Like I'm not actually close to her. I don't consider her a friend. And she was doing my makeup because she's a makeup artist, and she stopped halfway through, and she looked at me, and she went, "There's your Slytherin," <laughs> and I went, "Oh." Like, it's talking about my deep downs. Yeah, okay, interesting. <laughs> we have a really, really good Slytherin. <laughs> I'm just really deceptive. <laughs> I feel like, what is it? Um, I swear there's like a flower or something that looks really nice, but when you get too close, it hurts you. You know, like just that, oh, you're really cute, but it's going to hurt you. Koalas, probably. Probably a good one. Anyway, make, I, I feel like I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Probably like that. So like I said, I'm naturally heroic, so I think I confused for a Gryffindor. Yeah, no, for sure. It is interesting. It's it's interesting to see what what you show. Lego, I've got another one for you. That's actually I got from the Midnight Beast. Um, which great band, who's no longer making music. I say great. Not like, wow, their music's amazing. It's, they're just funny. I think they're funny. I love the Midnight Beast. <laughs> I liked them a lot when I was growing up. Um, but I do like that one. Slither into your Chamber of Secrets is a good one. Um, Aloha Mora Your Legs and I'll Slither In is another one. You can have that one for free. <laughs> Gryffindor's probably your rising. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Venus Flytrap. Yes. I'm like, come on. Nothing wrong with me. I'm fine. I'm really sweet, actually. And I get close enough and it's stop. <laughs> <laughs> For those that aren't aware of astrology, briefly, um, your rising sign is how you sort of portray yourself. Your sun is kind of what you are and your moon is your emotional side. If you wanted to play with how you how your Hogwarts houses would probably fit in that. <laughs> Let go! I haven't heard that one. That is oh, I don't know if I like it. <laughs> oh my god. Lego, like, if anyone came up to me in a bar or anything and like, you know, slid their arm across the across the bar bench and was like, Hey, are you Gringotts? Because I want to make a deposit. I would throw up in my mouth. <laughs> I'm, I'm telling you now. <laughs> I'll go, that's funny, but I'm going to be sick. <laughs> you do. You do, Lego. Oh god, that oh that made me feel so yuck. <laughs> I feel violated. <laughs> oh. <sighs> okay. <laughs> your moon side would be slit. Oh, you'd have Slytherin moon. And your sun is always Ravenclaw. Absolutely. 
Yeah, well, there you go. I love I love astrology. I find it so fascinating. I have someone who, um... I have a family member who's really into astrology and we live together for a little bit, long enough to be able to sort of learn. And, um... Yeah, it was just really fascinating. You know, I'm not against any of it. I'm not someone to look at you and go, you're into astrology? Pfft, you're into numerology? <laughs> What's wrong with you? You know? It's so fascinating. And it's... Okay, one thing that I really don't like about astrology that really annoys me is that I want to believe that it's just a made-up thing. But why is so much of it so accurate? <laughs> I hate it. It makes me really uncomfortable. <laughs> I thought you accurate my heart. Oh, that one's sweet. <laughs> it's better than making a deposit to Gringotts. <laughs> what star sign are you? Do you know your? Actually, if you guys are interested, I do have a link to um somewhere where you can type in all of your information it'll give you your whole full chart information and sort of break it down for you if you're interested i can chuck that in the chat for the exact same way i want to believe this ridiculous but i just can't right it's just i don't i take it with a grain of salt but it's fun <laughs> also male and female makes a difference as well i we found out i know know there are people that are like oh i really don't like this sign but the only gender they've ever met of that sign is you know one of them and then they meet the other one and it's the same star sign they go oh but i like you that's weird so that makes a difference as well which we found out <laughs> you know yours and your chinese one as well oh i'd love to get to know the chinese one I'm just fascinated. I've talked to other people and they've gone... The Chinese one feels more accurate to them. Oh no. We're gonna listen to Percival talk while I get rid of my hiccups. <laughs> it's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and might I presume She's you also share our Karen ability to, you. to see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We're special. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Mm -hmm. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Rude. Does Karen care? Oh, are you a seer? I reckon I should ask statues that. Statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside. Those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Mm. Very well. Okay. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Okay, sir. Your creation of ancient magic has unlocked one talent. To receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level, you have talent points. Yay! You're a fire rabbit and a water ox. How do you find out? Do I just look up Chinese astrology or? You've intrigued me now. Also, Duolingo's yelling at me because I have an hour and a half before I lose my streak. And I'm kind of tempted to do a short lesson <laughs> on stream. It is for Greek. Greek. <laughs> and it's super quick. But it's also only seven days because I had to redo it. So doesn't matter. Hearing you say fire rabbit and water ox makes me think of Patronus. 
That is all Patronus things. You look at the Chinese zodiac. Okay, I will look it up because I'm interested now. I know my animal just because of the year that I was born, but that's as far as I've kind of gotten. I know my year, I guess. Oh, I have 12 talent points available? Dang. Oh, actually, yeah, I want my incendio one. Yeah, this one. This one's really useful. I'm so used to it. Akio is also really useful for me. Dark arts. We haven't got anything with dark arts yet, but... Do we preemptively get it? I think we preemptively get it. I'm pretty sure I get Crucio first anyway, right? Oh, Expelliarmus. <gasps> Maybe I start using Expelliarmus more? I don't know. We'll find out, right? Spell knowledge. <gasps> yes, no, I need one of these. Please, 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 please. Actually, I'm going to get two. We're going to jump ahead. Because it's really useful. Yes. Oh, and this one. I love this one too. I'm just forgetting things again that I liked last time. Oh. That's really a decent one too, actually. Ancient magic throw. Catches and throws disarmed enemy weapons. Oh! That's pretty good. All right, Maddie, let's hear it. What's your perfect pickup lane? Should I be nervous? <laughs> Basic cast impacts on airborne enemies contribute more to the ancient magic meter. Oh, you okay? You okay? Successfully evading an unblockable attack with dodge contributes to the ancient magic. Oh, a lot of these contribute to ancient magic. Enemies struck with super fire remain stunned for a longer period of time. I like that idea. Wigan World 2! That is strong. You got me stage 5 house elf? I might need more elaboration on that one. It's gone over my head because I'm not the smartest of people. Enemy's bleed re is reduced. Allows you to sprint. Do I want to be able to sprint? Yeah, sure. I'm going- Oh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> I see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I see where you're going with that. I was wondering you were going to say something about being a free L for- Nope. You're going full Dobby, got it. <laughs> God. <sighs> this chat, man. This chat. This is an interesting chat. What are some other? Actually, you know what? Why not? Let's let's open it up. Let's open it up, shall we? Let's aloha more of this this bad boy. Why would I need the book? If you gave me clothes, I'd just give them back. So you can be my slave. Is that how that works? We have to see you, my Oh, thank you. Lovely to meet you. We'll see you again, I suppose. Not really meeting you. <laughs> it's like I say, great minds. <laughs> I see. I see what you're doing. I see what you're doing there. Oh, oh, eh, eh, oh, eh, oh. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Hmm. 
And yet, what are you doing, Karen? Oh. Hello, Key. Why are you going that way now? Silly Key. Where are we going, my dear? Where do we go? What? Aren't you? Oh, there you are. And we schlep. And we schlep. Got it. You need to learn to pulso the banishing charm. Do I? For pushing objects or other you shall not away. be named. Complete the required tasks and meet they me in my They call me you shall not be named. <laughs> I just had Miley Cyrus go off in my head. <laughs> it's good. It's good. Rebellion. Sleeping Dragon Statue, the Hogwarts motto, Draco Dormiens Nunquam Titulandus, means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Fortunately, this particular sleeping dragon is made of stone and will never awaken. It may be tickled to absolutely no effect. I like to think that you tickle it and he still comes up. Nothing there? Okay. I'm hearing the ding when I'm looking for something else, because then I go, now where is it? Now I have to look for it. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, okay, I'm very briefly just going to go and get my cape because I am cold. So I'll be back in a split.
Patience, I'm nice and warm now. I need to get my my school cape because it's freezing. <laughs> it's freezing here in Australia. What temperature is it? Oh, it reckons about seven degrees Celsius, but I feel like it is a lot, a lot lower than that. Who are you up to? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, I was going to read all these letters too. I wanted to read these letters in case there's anything that we can be friends with. You need to learn to pull so useful for pushing objects, blah blah blah. Come to my classroom. Uh, additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I've given you. Come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Gringotts. I remember to report my sister Helen survived that sudden attack in Azkaban. She said she does not hold a grudge against Anne. As terrible as the violence was, after seeing the conditions in Azkaban and knew, Helen said it's no wonder Anne's mind is so far gone. It seems you have found Jackdaw's ghost and told me about Anne. Helen wants to let you know that he has evidently promised to work with the Ministry and Helen to see what, if anything, can be done for her. Oh, that's nice. Leonora, a portrait in our common room wants to talk to you. He used to be the Ministry of... Oh, I think I've already done that one, haven't I? Train dummy's still available. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I'd like to talk with you about Rockwood and Harlow. Oh, I feel like we already did that one as well. Sound preview, dueling method. See if you have a new school champion. Meet me in the usual place. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Fantastic. Sounds pretty cool. It is. Let me see if I can translate that to Fahrenheit for everyone who is Fahrenheit. To me, it, it, <laughs> it feels like three, four degrees, but Google reckons it's seven. I say Google. Maybe my computer reckons it's seven. Um, 7 C in F. Okay, it's at 44 degrees Fahrenheit. That feels so wrong to me. <laughs> it sounds so wrong. To me, 44 is scorching hot. You can cook an egg on the sidewalk with 44 degrees. That's Celsius. <laughs> You would have said 35. Oh, you were close. Very close. I say very close. To me, it feels very close. What's three degrees? Because it probably feels like 35. Ah, 36. <laughs> so close. Very close. <laughs> Oh, quest one. Oh, it gives you like a little underneath what it is. Or what's left, I guess. Flying! <gasps> We're going to prioritize flying. No worries, Professor Sharp. We are going to get our flying license. So excited to finally go flying. Open the doors. Not a big fan of the time trial thing. Yeah, no, neither. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. I'm hoping I can do it better this time. Clotten, the first time. Please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. <laughs> the student the looks older than the teacher. To remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, the room has a huge price gadget. Oh, absolutely. Will be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, I take it? Now, <laughs> that feels such well so forced. Their practice over the summer holidays. Boo. For those who need a refresher, Step up to your broom, say up, firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. 
Karen came out 35 at birth. She sure did. <laughs> One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A Why gust not? of wind will throw you right off. Ah, oh, says you. I reckon running room would be so uncomfortable. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. There's no real seat on a broom, you know. Oh, you've got your feet Good. straddle holders now, though. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Cool. Do take oh. care. No, I like it the other way, please, and thank you. I like it down to go up and up to go down, please, and thank you very much. But where- oh, whoops, it's not that one. This one. I mean this one. <laughs> Invert- fly controls! Yes, please! Thank you! She's only a 50 and she's already pushing 45! <laughs> it's true! I there we go, that's another one. one piece. This'll take some getting used to. Wish I had my own broom. Good grip! Thank you. Whee! Well done. Thank now you. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, sure. let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Okay. Shall we? Maybe. What's this the more advanced? This set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What have you? Yay! Nice day for a flight! <laughs> That wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Oh, got my much needed tea. It is very cold. Looking forward to getting our own broom and hopefully, hopefully, it can be a little bit quicker. Why oh, does she look so- I know! <laughs> She's like, uh, do I have to? <sighs> this sucks. Oh, cool. That is loud. <laughs> she does look so bored, I didn't even think of that. <laughs> This feels really slow too, is it just me? Oh, well done! Have a moment! Yay! I say, I watched you fly through those rings. I you say you handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine <laughs> She's you're ready for like two minutes is already over it, right? Challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Hello, Everett. Am I right in suspecting that a Hufflepuff like you might be interested in some high-flying fun? High-flying fun? I don't think so. Kagawa seems strict. I wouldn't want to get into trouble. Kagawa Correct. won't even notice. Besides, a bird doesn't learn how to fly by staying in the nest. Thank Hello. you, Lego. I agree with you, I thought it felt super slow when I was doing it too. Well, yeah, I mean it is also the and first. Over the transfiguration courtyard. <laughs> yes we are. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the garden. I think for your first time flying. It's probably also good too. I remember when I first. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. There we go. Now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? Hippogriff. 
There's the famous bridge. Like I finally returned. Holding it up. And yes, the practice forget. room, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Plaintiffs and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. Oh, there's a Quidditch pitch that no one's ever going to use. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Yeah, I remember the first time that I played this game, it was still really difficult, even though it was slower, or it felt slower. It... Yeah. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Nowhere. It's his oh, fault. Hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points mm -hmm. will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. I told him. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're I... still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. Well, he kind of deserved that, didn't he? As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. I tried. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Well, you know, I am a natural. Did you know who I am? <laughs> Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, <laughs> those views were worth it. I wish we hadn't gotten in trouble. Perhaps, but we did get in trouble, and Kagawa could hold it against us. Mm -hmm. Rotten luck, that. I didn't think she'd see us. But it's no matter. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I'll have to purchase a broom, then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I, I will. recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. Thank He's you, Everett. I will. always to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Hmm. These have Quidditch game on PlayStation 2. Oh, really? How was that? I never played that. I never saw it either on PlayStation. To be fair, I mostly had it on... Uh, I mostly had an Xbox. <laughs> Aha! <laughs> I raise my wand to you. I've not forgotten about our library venture. Oh. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. What is I know here? A discreet place near there. Oh! <laughs> I don't mind me. Please, Velio. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus I didn't on see studies. anything. There was nothing here. Whoops, a daisies. Oh, wonder, can I reach you? No, nah, okay. Wait for Gunfringo. Ooh, I haven't explored. Ooh, apologies. I haven't gone exploring around Hogwarts yet. Not around here, anyway. Ah, oh, I feel so bad for these ones. And the whimpering? Ugh, oh, poor thing. It's honestly sick. No way. Rebellion. I thought I was driving close faster. Seeker, you did. You did. This is true. Ooh, what is here? This is ex. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Someone needs to learn Alohamura. And that someone is me. Mm. Um, yeah, we know it's in that room. Oops. We found that out one way. Oh, what's over here? Don't mind me whilst we go exploring. Oh, what's in here? Oh, what a pretty carriage. Oh. Any Thestrals? No, because I would have seen that. Hello. <laughs> I 
not cool. Is there anything I can do with them? No. Whoops. No. Okay. Oh, if I open their door. Ah, oh, never mind. It closes pretty quick. Never mind. You could play as the four Hogwarts houses, but then you could also play as like national teams like Norway, Australia, China. No way! That is so cool. Oh, how awesome. I feel like I should see if I can get it now. Damn, I need a Lohamora. A Lohamora. Was it just Quidditch? Was that what, what it was called? I still have a PlayStation 2, so now I'm like, oh, maybe. Maybe I find this game and I play it. Oh, the Quidditch Stadium. Which looks locked off and I can't actually do anything with. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Just wish that like I could still play it. I have to see if it came on Xbox or something. Do you not have your PlayStation anymore? Or a PlayStation? I'm sure that somewhere... Do you know what it was called? Because you have piqued my interest. <sighs> Oh. Came out in 2007. Okay. I have all the PlayStations and all the Xboxes. <laughs> That's the only thing that I kind of tend to hoard, I guess. I'm a collector. It's much nicer way of saying hoarder. <laughs> I'm a collector of consoles and all my consoles still work. So I can definitely get the PlayStation oh. one. What? Oh, but I... But I redeemed the dash. Why is there no dash? Where are my talents? Did I not get dash? I thought I dashed. No, oh, it's not a spell. I'm sure it's cool. Yeah. Oh, maybe I can't do it on school grounds. Also possible. Thanks, Maddie. Oh, I'm excited. Can I also get a broom? Or not yet? I am. Oh, I do want that one too. A demanding delivery. What's this? Oh, that's right. Sure. Let's let's start with this stuff. We're going to start with some of the smaller... Some of the side quests a little bit first and then we'll move on. I would like to go to Hogs... No. No. Silly. We want to go to Hogsmeade and we are going to appear. Hold on. This one, thank you. This tea set is. Harry Potter Quidditch World Cup. I feel like I can see the cover of it. Now that I've read that, I'm picturing it. I never played it, never got it. <laughs> I played all the other ones. I played up until Order of the Phoenix. I didn't know that they had a Half-Blood Prince. Wonderful. Wonderful. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Yeah, Shop's I wasn't. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel mm. as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've Damn. only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Sure Got a few rare U weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. We'll have to have a look. I'll have a look. Sounds Thank quite you. the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. I think we go what with the ember one. You know, Karen, pretty hot headed, right? That item is of the highest quality. I like the idea of having this, but no. What was the last one I had? Was it a U Weaver? Comfortable and speedy. I like the speedy. Stylish room with a light quality. touch. I don't know what my last one was. Was it a Moon Trimmer, maybe? It's also on the Xbox. <gasps> I have to get a new gen console now just so I can play it. No way. 
Angie, Merry Christmas. There's no alert sounds, unfortunately. I'm still getting my head around. Um, I wonder if I can. I wonder if I can set up commands through stream elements. I'm intrigued. You found me! I'm so happy you're here! Welcome! How are you? <laughs> How's your week going, my love? Oh, there we go, Ember. That makes sense. Right? You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. We we'll have a Tim Tam Slam in a sec too. Will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class. They all have their limitations. You seem to be a Angie. flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements. Potentially. Ha! Knew I was right about ha. you. I think you'll be quite happy. Andrew, you'll be fine. Lower altitudes. But I believe in you. Is that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise? I believe I can remedy this issue. I have mm. some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flights and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. See, As it happens, what I understood from this conversation was that these upgrades would be free. For time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. Because the way that he words it sounds like you, you test for it the for best me. Time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved. I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Oh no, my tea was too hot for my cookie. Well, I was doing great until my Tim Tam Slam didn't work, Angie. I was too impatient. Needed my Tim Tam. <laughs> Is that your price gouger? Ah. Oh. It's so, it's so, like, it's, I don't know. I feel like it's really deceiving, personally. Free is good? Oh, free is good, yes. I was like, where did that come from? Oh, it's talking about free upgrades. Yes, but the upgrades aren't free. The upgrades are like $600 each time you go. He's like, I've, I've got an upgrade I want to test. I'm like, cool, let's test an upgrade. Test an upgrade. To me, if I'm testing your upgrade, you're giving it to me for free or at least a discounted price for me to test your upgrade. But no. The last room. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, it's it's ridiculous. I'm like, oh, okay. I'll at least get a discount because I'm testing it for you. No, no, no. I'm upgrading my broom. So stupid. Um... Karen doesn't care about that. Karen knows she's the right person for this. And she doesn't care about his history. Cool. That sounds intriguing. Much easier to jump to conclusions do. when you don't know Thank their history, you. you know? It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special prize. Mm. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Time trial time! Time Once trial you time. Beat Imelda's time be sure to let me know. Oh, easy. Easy. But first I'm going to loot your shop. Thank you very much. Can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Where is Art oh, over here? Rebellion. I hate that guy. He's the worst. He's almost as bad as Professor Black. Professor Black, my friends. I don't think so. No one can be as wonderful. <laughs> I, swear, I can't even say it with a straight face. As Professor Black. Spint which is sporting needs. Run by the amiable. Mm, debatable. Albie Weeks. This shop sells all manner of wizarding sporting goods, including the latest broom models. Gossip around town is that Albie himself is working on a number of broom enhancements. Yes, he is. They also cost a lot, lot of money. A lot, a lot of money. We're going to go to this quest too, because it is here. Right? Yes. 
I hate that guy. He's the worst. <laughs> he is. House elves I just realized it was the same message as before that I just read. But the start of that sentence still makes sense with what I had just said as well. Did I just run past a cat and not pat the cat? Hello, kitten. They're so cute. He chopped off his elf ear. What do you mean, <laughs> wonderful? Yes, but he sets the rules. Don't you understand Karen's priorities here, Maddie? We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Do ya? Oh, we'll do. You need help with the delivery? Karen doesn't really help, Hello, but you know, if she gets something out of you it, maybe. Help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatimella Wang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often? Maybe Give she wants no to get to know to you. If you take this Maybe the potions are a uh, off my hands. Wait to see I'd you more. happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. <laughs> Priorities are obviously skewed. Exactly. Ah, she sounds annoying. I'd rather not deal with difficult people, but for a reward, I think <laughs> there it is. Manage. Indeed. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Is that so? What prioritize pain and suffering? Avelio. I've read another one in here, haven't I? What am I... Okay, no, we're good. We go out here. And I believe... You know what? Let's deliver the invisibility potions. We've already patted that kitty cat, so we can... Let me through! Incendio. See, it doesn't affect anyone. They just move out of the way. <laughs> They're just like, what was that? <gasps> Excuse you, children. Get away from there. <laughs> They're barely bothered by it. Whatever. Whatever. Oh, we're going down this way. Oh my goodness, look how far it is. I'm so glad we got the broom. That's why I got the broom. So that we may fly to this one. Because it is far too far away. Ah, oh, never mind. I'll think of something else. Let's go! Ooh! This girl is on fire. This room is on fire. This room is on fire. I think it's dumb how you can't plan. Yeah, I agree. I'm okay. Wait, did they fix it so it's more of a dome shape? I hate that it's a. I hate that it's a cylinder. If it was a dome and it says you can't fly in Hogsmeade or Hogwarts, I'm like, okay, that's fine. But let me fly over Hogsmeade because I don't want to have to keep making this huge circle around Hogsmeade to get to the other side. Let me fly over Hogsmeade. Just have it as a dome shape instead of a, a cylinder. There's people below. Fairly well. Fairly well, Ogre. Zoom. Oh, what is this? I see a question mark on a scroll. You have piqued my interest. I don't know what it is. Oh, I'll take some of these though. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Oh, hello. What is this? Rebellion. Oh, that's what it is. 
Mertlap tentacles. Mertlap tentacles are a rare potion ingredient known to raise resistance to certain dark charms and contain healing properties. An overdose, however, can cause purple ear hair. Ooh. Good to know. Good to know. I 100% agree with that. Yeah, it makes sense, right? Do we do these balloons on the way? We do these balloons on the way. No. Oh, I hate these. Ah, oh, I always miss at least one. It's just really hard to control. I'm going back for it. Don't you worry. This must be it. Oh. <laughs> I needed to be here anyway. Why not? Let's do this while we're on our way. <laughs> we happen to be in the right spot, so we might as well. Okay, where is it? Over here? Over here. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Arn will regret not joining us. If he doesn't come round now, he'll be made even more of an example. Is that so? I want to see if there's a way over here that I can get in. Oh, I think there is a way over here that I can get in. Delightful. I think you should just be able to fly over whatever town you want. And when you did it, especially if there's enough space to land the broom. Because even annoying they can't land on some cliffs. Yeah, no, I agree. I mean, there are some cliffs you purposely can't land on because that's their way of, like, that's the end of the map and you actually just can't land on it. Oh, I wonder if I can... I wonder if I can jump over. No? Alright, well. Broom it is. What? There's not enough space to call my mount? Oh, that's cool. I didn't know I was calling it. I mean, it makes sense that I would be, but... You can't see me. You can't see me. Anyone underneath me? Doesn't look like it. Oh, look at all these people. Look at all those chickens. Oh, I'll take this though. Thank you very much. The end of the map soon will be by yellow bar. Oh! Last time I played it was just a red wall. Good to know. Not here. You would not know, would you? Oh! Wait an enchantment. The carts are returning to Arn. Can I do this without attacking anyone? <laughs> They're not gonna say anything? That's hilarious. Reminds me of the time I nearly fell out of a cart at Green Dot. I was oh, the heck? Well, not like I'd fall out now. Lucky if I fit in one now. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, I a grapple on you are. You gonna come through? Go on, in you go, in you go. Surely I can do the thingy thing, can I? Yes, thank you very much. Amazing, wonderful. Don't be crazy if you do this without attacking one. Well, I was tempted to not attack anyone, but... But... Do I do it? I'm so tempted. There's one over here too, right? Yeah, I'm tempted to see if I can just lure them out, you know? <laughs> Ninja Karen. 
I always get so quiet. Oh, I wonder if I can... I kind of want to whip one over, but if I Accio one over, it's not going to end well. Will be me, 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 me. Is there only three people here? Really? Oh, easy. Are you ready for this? I'm not. You know, what if I like sneak over here and then I Accio him over here? I wonder if I can like sneak him over. Yeah, no, maybe. <laughs> That'll work, right? Whoop! Never mind, I didn't realize. Oh, ouchie, ouchie, ouchies. I thought I dodged that. Rude. Smack. Okay. Well, there's a lot more people here than I thought there was going to be. Oh, ouchies. Not quite, huh? What? There's someone else here? Who else is here? Hello! Who else is here? Oh, you're up here. Hello. Oh. Amazing! Incredible! Is there anything else? Anyone else? Hello? Anyone else? Never use that spell that you just used in that goblin. Which one? Incendio? I love Incendio. I always upgrade it too. Oh, I do need that. At some point soon. Just gonna grab all this quickly. After we grab all this, then we are going to. I'm gonna collect all of this stuff. Um. Oh, I need that for something. Where does it go? Oh, they go. Where was it? Pretty sure there's one up here that it needs to go into. Yes. Was it up here? Oh, I don't need to take you. I guess. Oh. When we snuck on paralyzed. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Petrificus Totalis. Yeah, no, that's that's a good one. I really like Petrificus Totalis. Where, oh, where is the thingy thing? I kind of want this to be daylight because I can't see. I'm also just blind. You've been I'm paying a attention in defense against the dark arts, I see. There's one guy left and he's still talking to himself. That's great. That's hilarious. I think it's hilarious. It's made me giggle, so, you know, it counts, right? Up here, maybe? Ah, here it is. That's what I was looking for. And there should be one more somewhere. Is it? Ah, oh, it's that one. over here please guys thank you i hope that worked huzzah is it only two i kept trying to figure out how to do it and didn't know until i watched a video today where it oh right yeah just gotta get really close and stay really quiet he mind controlled an ogre and they do that to him oh Oh, that's an idea. I didn't think of using it that way. Ah. Smart. Very smart. Where are the balls? I want the balls. 
Surely there's more balls somewhere. Maybe is it up here somewhere? There we go. Just need to get it out of the... There we go. Let's give this a go. I'm not a stealthy guy. <laughs> I hate the torture curse too much. That is fair enough. That is fair enough. <laughs> Oh, it's just a chest up here? Oh. Brown eye of newt goggles. Lovely. Is there anything else? Where is the last one? Oh, maybe it's outside here somewhere. I would not be surprised. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, man, I know you're here somewhere. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Incendio. I don't know how close I needed to be for him, but you know, I thought I'd rather be too close. <laughs> Not close enough. And I leveled up, so you know. Not bad, not bad. Where are the balls? I want the oversized gobstones, please. You can't be too far, right? Oh, it's just flock of crows. I thought it was something else. What's up here? Is this where it is? No? Oh, oh, here it is. Ooh. Well, 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 would you look at that? Well, well, well. Now, where are the balls? Where are the gobstones, please? What on earth? Are they over here perhaps? Somewhere? I'm pretty sure they're outside somewhere. I have done this before. I just don't know where. Excuse me sir, you haven't seen a clump of oversized gobstones anywhere. I will say the running mechanics are hilariously robotic. They are. They are. Actually, there is one mechan one animation that I really like, and that's them running down the stairs. Like that little like hop, like their arms come up and they sort of hop down the stairs. I love it. I think it's such a good animation. They did that one really, really well, I think. Are they up here, maybe? Surely, I thought they'd be down there somewhere. I know there are sometimes with these where they'll go, whoops. Where they'll make it more difficult, but. Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Those facts, I love that, right? Where are the damn gobstones? Oh, there's a chest up here. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Ooh. Oh, my necks are full. My necks are full? <laughs> my gear slots are full. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh my gosh. This is annoying me. I am frustrated. Oh. Oh, no, it's an animal up there. Which quest is this? Um, to get over here, it is carted away, is the quest. And you get it from Natty. Oh, no, you don't get it from Natty. Where you meet Natty, that's like just outside of Hogsmeade, in that little village, there's a goblin, I think, who has his cart stolen, and you have to help him. It's an optional side quest if you want to do it. Where on earth? 
feel like I found them once, but I accidentally stumbled upon them. That's how I found them. Just be careful not to open a master chest win here. Oh, and slots are full because you never get that item again. Oh! Okay, now that's good to know. I should go and sell all of my items then. Where in the fricky frack? You think you've done this quest? I feel like if you hear someone yelling out when you're nearby, <laughs> someone you tend to go over. Oh, you didn't do the Merlin trial with it? Every time I see a Merlin trial, I try and use it. Defeat enemy with Petrificus Totalis? Well, they even treat me. What's over here? Oh! Oh, I'll take that too. Thank you. Oh no! My gear starts off. Oh, damn it. Damn it. I watched the video a couple of days ago and I started selling my items before I go on another quest. No, that's good thinking. Can I kill these guys with Petrificus Totalis? No way. <laughs> that was easy. Well, poor doggies. Well, did that one. I need to go find the rest of the gobstones. Do the trials, how yeah, do the trials how you get more in inventory space. Correct. And I get really annoyed when I do most of them. And then there's one bit of the Merlin trial that's gone. Like this one. And I can't find it. So frustrating. So, so frustrating. Anything interesting here though? <laughs> While I'm standing here? Whilst I'm walking around, I might as well look. You could an animal? I guess so. I didn't know you could. Until right now. Ah, oh, I was hoping it was going to blow up or something. I know where to practice it if you if you ever want to practice your petrificus totalis you can practice on an animal instead of people can I oh I can't even jump up where are they this is driving me nuts It shouldn't be this difficult. Although it also kind of should be because it's a... Oh, did I? I thought it only worked on humans and goblins or trolls. Yeah! Yeah, me too. I didn't know it even worked on trolls. So it's actually really exciting to know that it works on trolls because trolls are an absolute pain. Mm hmm. Are they hidden in here somewhere maybe? I do remember I had to drag them out from somewhere, but I don't remember where. Revenia. I'm definitely gonna- yeah, no, go for it. It's a great way to practice. Where? Merlin try early soon. I got angry as well. It's so frustrating! It's right here. It shouldn't take this long and it's the worst one I've been running around like this for ages and then I find out it's literally right next to it. <gasps> oh, actually, no, I think it's under here. <laughs> well, if you ever do this melon trial, you know where they are now. I remember them being hidden somewhere. I forgot where though. Oh my goodness, I'm so glad that I found them eventually. That should be all of it. That should be all of them. Huzzah! We did it! Jesus. That took so long.
Okay, now we can deliver the invisibility potions. <laughs> I doubt she's still working, but you know, we can still get there. Thank you, Maddie. Thank you. Got there eventually, but you know, better late than never, right? Oh, another Merlin trial. Why don't we do this one while we wait for her to start up? Should have been here by now. Oh, she's actually still Always working. Keen on keen bridge. <laughs> That's all I'll say. Keen in keen bridge. Haha. <laughs> we just need to learn more patience. I'm really pretty patient. It's just frustrating when I'm like, it's right oh, there, but it's right there. Thing. Hello, madam. You know what time it is, right? Madam Luong, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have your brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. She's so rude. Why'd you buy him then? Why do you keep ordering from him if you think the quality to be inferior? Because I it love him. I have more and more customers who are trying to stay out of sight. I'm not one to judge. You can simply imagine the stress I'm under to deliver quality products. Mm -hmm. Unlike some vendors, I strive to keep my customers satisfied. Great. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. Ooh. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Drink it. I'd rather not. I'd rather not, but if you insist. So Wait, what? <laughs> I do insist. <laughs> I don't want you have to drink it. That's funny. It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions like is as high as you here say, comes well, it would be mean. Yeah, easier right. Easier to work with, perhaps combining your recipes and skills. Ooh. <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us have to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Right. No, I don't care about her customers. Very well. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. There is something else I found here, um... I should be Matty, that I Thank don't know you. if you found while you were here. Which I'm going to find yet again. Aside from the Merlin trial. Where is it? Here. Her potion recipes for, um... Oh, did I learn to pulso? I forgot if I learned to pulso. I haven't learned it yet. Damn it. Oh, I need to pulso for this. Damn it. Damn it. Because Accio is too weak. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I'm going to get my revenge through my Slytherin playthrough. That's the spirit. <laughs> oh, I thought I was close enough. Ginger Root. The barkeeping Cambridge keeps a stock of ginger root handy to fend off his customers' nausea and keep them inviting a bit longer. Inbidding? Inbiting? There you go. Well, let's drink a bit of alcohol, shall we? I mean, uh, butterbeer. I wonder if he can get drunk. Can he get drunk in this game? I kind of hope you can. You found it, yeah. You can find a potion book and you can take it back to Pippin. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Oh, you can't get drunk. Oh, that's sad. That'd have been such a fun mechanic. Oh, whoops, my girl's lots of full. I may want to see your wares, madam. I would like to just sell my stuff. <laughs> Being real selfish. Where are we? Okay. Yeah. 
I'm going to wear this. Oh, lovely. And we're going to... No, we're not going to wear that. That's the best one I've got, I think. Lovely. This one... Is this one better? Oh, it is. <laughs> it doesn't look better, but... That's not the point. That does not matter. This one is much better. Oh, oh! This one's all even better. What is going on? Okay, then we wear that one, of course. <laughs> Does he pay for it? Oh, I don't remember. We're going to find out, though. Headwear, none. Outfit. Whoops. Um... This one. Uh, we don't have any cloaks and robes, that's fine. Neckwear, none. Beautiful. Beautiful. Hello, madam. I like to sell nice things. Nice to see you again. Likewise. What can I help you with today? Nice to see you, is it? What do you have for sale? I like how you can make an item look like any other what item. Do I do too. Today? I would love if you could have set this will do just um fine. thank you you know save your outfits whoop i have upgraded my gloves so you can have you know i like this outfit together this outfit together this outfit together and then whenever you upgrade your outfit to make it easier to kind of go back into thank the other one in. you can just click on whichever saved outfit you have I think that would be awesome, personally. What am I? Gear. Where are we? Handwear. This one? This one. Oh, I don't think I was high enough level to use it at the time. Maybe this one too? This one too. We are learning. Like on Red Dead. Hey, you can see them on your horse. All oh, right, that'd be sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I think that'd be a great idea. Just because there are so many options, and I've seen other people play too, and they've said, you know, I like having my outfit like this for. Oh, that was a waste of my time. Uh, you know, I like this outfit for when I'm riding my broom. I like this outfit for when I'm doing this. I like this outfit for when I'm doing that. And I love that idea. It's just every single time that you go to do something else or whatever, you have to sit there and go through each individual thing and redo it and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, oh, it's just more of a nuisance than it's worth, really. Oh, you're over here. Ooh, looks like a beehive. Oh, look at that, beehives. The wizarding world needs honey for their tea as much as the muggle world does. Fair enough. Oh, sweet. Sweet like honey? <laughs> Change my outfits like 10 times. Right? Like, I think it'd be so nice to be able to... Um, I could totally fast travel this. But we're going to chitty chat while we're here, right? It would be nice to be able to have them pre-saved to some degree. I love the idea of having different outfits for different occasions. If you're, you know, back at Hogwarts, changing into your school robes. If you're out and about, changing into something else, you know. I think that makes it just a little bit more fun. Here's a pleasant surprise. Jeez, don't sound too excited. My goodness. At least three times a day. It's so easy to. I'm always finding better gear. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. That's the other thing. I wish that... I think it would be nicer if, as you upgrade, it doesn't change your... Um... could speak that'd be great it doesn't change what current outfit you have on so you don't have to go upgrade into everything and then manually change it all or at least have it as a setting 
I wonder if it is a setting actually. I'd say I've ever checked to be honest. Rebellion. Anything of interest around Ooh, that's of interest. That might be an enemy colour though. Ah, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. Well, there's one. I don't know where the other ones are though. Oh, I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, there's one over there and there's one over there. Okay. Alrighty. Let's try this again. Let's wait for that to pop up. Okay. We have that one. Oh, come on! You can do it! I think I need Confringo for this one. I might need Confringo. Let's try it. I walk around everywhere in Ravenclaw robes. I don't even care. <laughs> they would be cool if they had one skins and not just handles. I agree. I think that'd be cool too. Incendio. Did that work? I don't think it hit. Hmm, okay, I'm gonna wait for Confringo for that one then, I guess. Alright, I suppose we wait for Confringo. And it would be also be cool if you customize things in your broom rather than just the entire skin. Yeah, I, that'd be cool too. I'd love to do like a different seat to a different, um, you know, like I'd like to put a lantern on the front of this instead of, yeah. Yeah, no, I agree. I heard someone say that different brooms have different, um, not qualities traits as well so like this the light and wispy broom is that actually feels quite light and wispy <laughs> I will tell I think the umbrella one would be cool I'd love if you could earn it through a quest or something you know there's a certain side quest or story quest or something where you earn it you know maybe you have to do something in Hagrid's hut I don't know Sorry, the groundkeeper's hut. It's not necessarily Hagrid's hut, but we all know it is Hagrid's hut. That'd be super awesome if the lantern was functional. Yeah! Well, there are some rooms where the lantern is functional to a degree. It lights up. I don't know if it lights up an area. Oh, it does! It can light up an area. I mean, it's a lantern, so it doesn't... It's not like a, a headlight. It doesn't light up a lot, but it does light up. I'm curious to know how far I can go in before it tells me to get off my broom. Oh, there it is. Rebellion. I'll definitely do that side quest immediately! <laughs> I can imagine you would! Hogsmeade, the only all-wizarding village in Britain. Hogsmeade has been a favourite haunt of Hogwarts students. Third years and up for centuries. I can't imagine why. I'd love to have some butterbeer. I had butterbeer once. I had someone make it for me because they knew the recipe. It was actually quite nice. It was surprising. I didn't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't what I had. And it was pleasantly really nice. It was non alcoholic. I don't think that you can have alcoholic butterbeer. Maybe you can. Can't say I've looked into it too much, to be honest. But it's just like a. I had warm butterscotch too. A warm butterscotch. Warm butterbeer. It tasted like butterscotch. It's very yum. It was butterscotch. It was like a butterscotch hot chocolate type of idea with um, whipped cream on top. It's really good. I delivered the potions. I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. 
Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? Karen's all about the gossip. Did you know you could buy Hagrid's wand and actually works as a real umbrella? <gasps> really? Oh, that's cool. I love that idea. I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Mm -hmm. I like an additional fear. That was way too far. Those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. Correct. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well. I shall increase your pay. But I'm not at all pleased about it. Can't By imagine the way, why. I found this book of potion recipes in Cambridge. There it is. Might it be useful to you? Is this Fatima's recipe book? <laughs> if it is, she doesn't deserve it back. <laughs> you should keep it. She doesn't deserve to have it. I appreciate what you're saying, but you have much to learn about respecting the property of others. Something Karen doesn't know what respect is. <laughs> I shall return it this to Karen, her anyway. immediately. Oh, that's no fun. Oh, you get a potion is kept though. That's exciting. You gotta buy one. It's pink, just like the movie. That's so nice. I love that they've made. You know, like they make some things where they're a collector's item, but they're not really. What's the word? Practical. So I love that you at least get something practical out of this. Is there anywhere anyone else? Zonko? Does anyone want some Zonkos? No, we're not going to get Zonkos. Not yet. I don't know where that's taking us. Is that in in the shop? What? Wait, where's it gone? It's gone now. Is it not in the? Oh, it is in the shop. Ooh, who needs our help? Where they go? Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to myself. I'm Clementine Willetsy. Charmed. I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Aww. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. Oh. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. Well, they still should horrible be. Horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. I wouldn't say it's irrational. It's silly, but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do. Yes. I love this little if reference. You wouldn't mind. <laughs> Spiders. Could we follow butterflies? What do you hear about the forest? Oh yes, we need to get Caramine. Ahem. <clears throat> Why can't you do it yourself? What were the horrible stories you were told about the Forbidden Forest? Oh goodness, everything from students being mysteriously beheaded to terrifying spider dens. Oh, oh well, spider dens are true. Trust me, <laughs> that at 11 years old, it sticks with you. That is fair enough. I'll think about it. Very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find you say kind. right around here. I hope to see you soon. I always wanted to get a wand, but I didn't Don't like any forget, of the ones they the came with. The butterflies always seem to be on the fringes of the Forbidden Forest. They're pretty cool, Good but luck. then they finally made his wand. I can see you have a very clear favourite. There are quite a few really nice ones. I don't find Bellatrix's one. Her one's kind of grown on me. I used to not like it very much, but... It's definitely grown on me. It's just unique. It's just weird. It's different. I'm not going to do the butterflies. She can wait. 
¿Cómo se suena? Oh, to learn to pulse it. Oh, I probably should do that, shouldn't I? Oh, I should probably also finish you. Yeah, okay, let's finish this one off. Get it over and done with. I suppose. I am also fully aware that I could have totally just uh, zipped over. What is it? Flu flume? Doesn't Zoros, awesome, but when I found that his wand was coming out, I had an actual working umbrella. Oh, yes, yes, no, yes. Yes. <laughs> Say less, 100%. No, that makes sense, yes. But you really can use it. I've got three wands that sit behind me that are collector's wands, but I've lost the um, little card for them. Frustratingly, they have moved too many times. Um... But they just sort of sit there and they collect dust, which they're still lovely and I love taking them out and they're really cool. But yeah, it'll be... It's just... It feels like clutter, but they're also collector's items, <laughs> you know? It's such a weird feeling for me with, with those. They work well and I'm so glad that I stream because I can sort of use them in the background and I can show people when they ask and whatnot, but... Yeah. No, it's definitely... It's yeah, also if you can ways. have something. And they're I'm expensive I too. Still don't have my carts. So. We don't have your carts. Oh, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good in wizard kind. Well, thank you for proving them Still wrong. a fool. It was difficult. The ones I faced were determined Had to go out of my way. Difficult. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. Uh-oh. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. I love this. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. It sounds a little excessive. I get it, like collector's items too. But I also like when people are like, <laughs> where'd you get that? And I feel like that's how it would be with this one. Yeah, 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 no, absolutely. I think, especially the fact that you can use it, it's, you know, it's a collector's item, yes, but it's also functional. It's a two-in-one, and that's so awesome. And it's so unique. It's a unique pink. That's, that's so cool. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> I'm not sure that's worthy of a painting. You'd be surprised at how art can touch people. I think it's well worthy. Thank you again. I think that wording is a little wrong help. for the wizarding world, right? Paintings can touch people. All the Their paintings can come you. to life. Once my I mean, right, I'd just... be happy to show you my wares. No, thank you. I mean, maybe. Depends how good your wares are. Your whereabouts. Ha <laughs> ha. So Hagrid's hut is here. And I remember seeing it was somewhere up over here. I forgot where. Was it around here, maybe? Maybe it was around here. I think it was further on. Where's Hagrid's hut? There. Yeah, no, it wasn't near it. It was a lot further of the way down. It was like down and up around somewhere. I don't quite remember it now. You know, let's do one of the time trials. <laughs> ah, my finger slipped off my controller. There we go. There we are. Lovely. Now my cord is caught there. Where's the Quidditch pitch? Let's go Quidditch. Let's go do a time trial. Is it up here maybe? Maybe is he up here? No, I don't think it's up here. I don't think it's... I think it's more out than up. Hmm. I have forgotten. What's up here? This place looks interesting. Oh, there's a couple of Merlin trials though. Check this out. Check this out. I know what that means. Merlin trial. I know what that means. I'm so proud of you. Now what was this one again? I 
keep forgetting what these ones are. What was it? No. I don't remember what it is. Lumos? No. I don't think it's repairing either. Repairer. I found it once upon a time and I have forgotten it since. Oh, I think I need to bring something to it. Oh, hello flowers. Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Hong Kong. <laughs> so silly. So, so silly. Got a couple of eggs here. Lovely, lovely, delightful. Can you please, please let me get up? That works too, I suppose. I suppose. I think I need something to go on it. But I don't remember what. Oh, well, another one that we come back to. What is that flying in the sky? What are all of these? <laughs> These kites are so cool! Can I make friends with the kids playing with the kites? <laughs> oh, they're not kids. Can I have a kite? Let's go fly a kite. Something, 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 something. Oh no! <laughs> I love doing that. Where is she? Is Mela? You have met Thank your you. match. Thank you for doing that's okay. Pleasure. Hello, Imelda. Imelda Rays? Albi Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. Ooh. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique. And that was the end of that. The nerve. Fair enough. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you I'm showing amazing. off in flying class with Clopton. Hmm? You sound jealous. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you. Uh -huh. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers and bumbling baboons. Bumbling for some baboons. Reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps well, I am competition. You're not oh. even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Rude. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can oh, beat it. Thank you, Maddie. I didn't Slithering know the lyrics. Versus Hufflepuff. <coughs> Let's go. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I don't think I can. Lose. But, you know, it's all about the attitude, right? We'll see. Oh, whoopsies, missed it. Oh my gosh. Woo. I just hate the camera controls, you know? We're almost there, we're almost there. Come on, we need to get through these bubbles. There you go, Karen. Love your work. Whoopsies. I loved your work until, you know, the controls got a bit funny. Oh, it's so... Just have everything on the left control and have my view on the right. Damn it. Like, it's so funny watching this part back because my head twists. <laughs> with it. I can feel it and I get really self-conscious with it. 
I'll read chat in just a sec. So stressful. Oh, Hate these damn controls. I'm doing a lot better than I was expecting though. <laughs> I was expecting to be a lot worse right now. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Hell yeah! God, what a time! So proud of that. Took a penalty on my first one and still smoked it. Hey, well done! <laughs> it's immersion. Yay! Well done, Maddie. My f <laughs> I'm actually, I'm going to be putting all of my VODs from my first ever playthrough because I did a three day, I streamed this for three days straight, um, but six times, nine times, three times each day. So I played it for three days straight uh, <laughs> and it was embarrassing. The controls are just really difficult. It's not normal controls. Being different on the left and right thumbstick is just... <gasps> That's not... You, you must have cheated, you... Oh, fine. You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't oh, determine skill from I've one single just trial. Begun. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Wow. Oh! I don't want your respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, uh, no, I didn't I want her to be like to that. Course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Alby Weeks. Mm hmm. There you are. The cross one's duelist to beat. That's me. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear yeah, how I the first person to lose. I have to. I hope the seven city will go away because of my disability. No, that's fair enough. Oh, I can't play first person shooters. I love watching them. I can't play them. I'm going to be playing Halo, I think, again soon, <laughs> though. No, I'm not done here yet. Excuse you, game. We do everything that's here first, and then I'll go and report back later. But not now. It's not important. <gasps> the room of requirement. I will do this one, though, because I do love this one. This is probably one of my favorite quests. Personally. Something bad. This makes me so happy. I love meeting Deke and hanging out with Professor Weasley. <gasps> Is this the one? Is this the time? Yay! I don't know what it is. It gets me every time. I think it's hilarious. You're really bad, except for Call of Duty Mobile. It's so interesting, isn't it? Just what... What works. <laughs> Leonora's complaining about me. <laughs> Can you imagine solving a riddle that I mentioned and not giving me the answer? She's competing with Imelda. That's hilarious. Maybe I am. Maybe I am. I remember the first time that happened. I walked right past when I was like, someone is getting beat down. <laughs> when I first streamed this, was it the first time? I think it was. Maybe it was 
the week after my first three day stream. But it was very early on in my streams that um, someone hopped in and was like, Hey, have you heard the Humming Nights? I went, No. Tell me more. And they directed me to them, exactly. And uh, the rest was history. I just think it's so funny. It's so funny. Highly recommend Call of Duty Mobile. It's a convention of all the previous Call of Duties. It combines nostalgia but with constant updates. That's so good! It sounds really good and I'll, I, I'm a sucker for mobile games. But I play a lot of the mobile games that are just like mind-numbingly uninteresting. Because it helps me if I'm ever anxious or whatever, it's just it's something for me to do to sort of distract myself. Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. This is away from prying eyes. You need to need it. You need to require it. Look how gorgeous is that? I really want to know how they did that. I have a degree in game development in art specifically. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? <laughs> I love her. After you, Professor. I think that's smart. I play a lot of mobile games, but that's what... Call of Duty does for me. Yeah, no, it's fair enough. I love seeing how different people are, you know? Some people need different kinds of games. And I was saying this in one of my other streams a while ago. That I love that there are so many developers and so many what is this place? This kinds is of games the out there for literally everyone. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely yeah. by accident. If ever. I don't have planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. I also now, love this. Where is Deke? <laughs> must have so sneaked silly. past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Okay. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach The room requirement Evanesco is so lovely. I also love spell. this part you leading up to it, Evanesco you know? to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movement first. It's such first, a... I don't know, something about it just feels really away. sweet. Evanesco. Splendid. One of my favorite things is how they leave snacks out in every house. I know! I love the snacks. I'm just sad they're not real. I love to keep walking past them. Meh. <laughs> Cast Evanesco on those chairs. Excellent work. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. We have peeps. Let's move on. <laughs> I like it. Rebellion. It's so nice. Where I in would... Merlin's name is that elf? I'd love if um you could. What is this? Hey, I waited you. Is that... I waited for you here for Goodness. ages. Perhaps you assigned a few more inches of parchment back. than you'd expected. Let me know if you want to try to meet again some silly tea. To. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just <laughs> take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. Okay. <gasps> Dear me. Ooh. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Apologies. The snacks look so good, and I would love to, if I, <laughs> while you're walking through, for them to just sort of pop up next to me. I'll happily have a donut or a cupcake or some fruit. Rebellion. Whatever I happen to stumble across in my common room, I'd love to snack on. Yeah. 
what's under here? Oh, nothing? Oh! Oh, I see. I see, I see. Now if I bring you back here a little bit, and then I jump up here... I don't have to pulse it on me, so... Aha! It still worked! Oh, nothing exciting though. <laughs> I love this room! I, I kind of wish that you could come back to it, you know? I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! Oh, not us. That's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! <laughs> I love all these little things that they have put into the game for everyone. I think that's so sweet. Such nice little Easter egg kind of ideas, you know? A bit offended of the room. <laughs> a bit offended the room thought I needed a bath. Cheeky thing. <laughs> oh, cute. All this stuff, like it's so cool. Oh, this is pretty. Hello. I feel like I've walked past every chest. I just haven't been able to actually open any. This is pretty. Very pretty. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? That's a good question. Asking the right questions here, Karen. Anything else of interest? What was Ooh. that? A key? Was that a golden snitch? Oh, no, it's a snitch. Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking it would be cool that when you got a letter, your owl, it's in your drawing room, would fly up to you and drop it at your feet. Yeah, I think that'd be cool too. At least have the option to, or, you know, with important letters or something, you know. Oh, they found. They seem so deflated. Do they need the other ones? Is that why? Do they need more? I think that'd be cool too, Maddie, if they could. Have that and just have it pop up the same way that it already does. Rebellion. So it's still not obstructing anything and it's not annoying you know where is that snitch i can hear you oh you're up there uh, okay never mind oh no i think i'm stuck oh no i'm stuck uh-oh buscadios <laughs> okay well let's hope i can uh push you away this way Okay, that works. That's, I hope that was enough. Excellent! We're good. We're fine. I feel great. Hope you guys feel great too. <laughs> Can I get in here? How do you get in here? Oh, was I about to climb through? I was saying it would be cool if you could get a howler. I know! I know! The howlers are so exciting for me. I, lo I love walking past and seeing some kids got a howler from their mom or something. I think it's so funny. Such a nice little addition. Yeah, like the yeah. No, I think that'd be really cool. If you could have an owl that just yeah, just does the animation, it just comes in briefly. Even if it's like in the top corner of your screen or something, it doesn't need to be anything huge. But yeah. Yeah, I think that'd be really cool. I meant to come over here, maybe. Come here, box. How do you get in? I don't know how to get in. 
How doth one enter the room? Oh, 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 maybe, maybe, because I'm smart sometimes. Rare, but happens. I think, I think maybe. Maybe if I push it. Oops. Oh, can I like break this down? Nope. Let's push that in as far as we can. We have to levitate. I'm gonna just try and push as close as I can to this and hope I can jump over the top of it, you know? I don't think I can jump up any other way. I need to get over it here. Whoops! Whoop. That wasn't my intention. Rude. Oh, I wonder if I can Evanesco it. Oopsie, strong button. Oops! <laughs> Close enough. Levitate and then crawl under. I can't crawl. Oh, you mean on this side? Right? Bring the box back in here and levitate it over on this side? Oops. Move this chair out of the way, dang it. Excuse me, stool. Out of the way, please. Thank you. Oh, that's gonna be such a flippin' pain. Out of the way, out of the way. Thank you very much. Oh, 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 e oh, oh. Back in here, please, Mr. Box. I believe I need you in here. Maybe? Oh. Ah, <laughs> I'm stuck. There we go. I can't actually crawl under the box. Oh, you mean this one? Hold on, let me jump up here and have another look. Yeah. Oop, I was having to pull myself towards you, but that's fine. Oopsies. Oopsies. Get nice and close. I can't crawl under it though. It just moves it. <laughs> oh! I can try to roll, but I can't. Quite get under it. Whoops. Oh. I don't think I meant it. <laughs> okay, sure. Whoops. I don't think I was meant to get up here. I'll, I'll take it. Flash it. No, it's all good. Oh, 
Oh. I'm gonna wait for that to go down now. I just need to bring it closer. Where's the other one that was underneath here? Not this one, you're fine. That box. I think if I... No, I don't want that one levitated! No, I wanted to get that one down, you stupid. There we go. This one I want to levitate, because then hope I can get that box underneath this one. And then I think if I pull this close enough here, I should be able to open the chest, right? Right? I said if I can pull that close enough here, I can open the dang chest. I can't use my broom in here either. I thought maybe the golden snitch made something. Crawl back out there in the hallway. So you mean here? Incendio. Oh. No, not that button. No, not that button. This button. I think I might need to do some levitation places. Now you gotta push that one back with the chest on it. Okay. Whoops. No, you Muppet. Am I supposed to fall through it, maybe? So, like, if I... Hmm. So, say, if I pull this one out... What? Well, if I can get out here. If I pull this box out of here and then bring it over here and levitate it... And then try and fall down between the chest and the thing, maybe I can fit in... I think it's an invisible wall. I don't think I'll be able to fit in it. Hmm. This is another way into it. It is also possible. Turn to my left. Over here. Let's see if one of these brooms work, maybe. No? Okay. Oh goodness, hello. <laughs> Spooky. Pulling that box out, levitating, I think that works. Come here, box. I don't know where to put you yet, but I feel like you need to come out here somewhere. Ooh. Can I jump up on here? I don't know how else I'm going to go anyway. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I feel like I need to... 
all this out here. Okay, this is a really bad example of what I'm trying to do. But I am thinking that I need to jump over it, like here. Whoops. Up your hop. Oh! Oh, 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 what if? What if? Okay, hold on. What if I... So I'm thinking if I bring this box back into this room and then I levitate the chest up and then whilst I'm standing on this box I can access the chest. I think that might have something to do with it. Now if I come over here I wait for this spell to go down and then where's the chest box? There you are. And then I bring you over here. Oh, 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 what if? What if? What if I bring you over? So then this becomes the new solid ground for him. Come on. Come on, Mr. Box, you got this. Come on. If I just hold this long enough and maybe move like side to side, will it eventually wiggle its way through? There we go, that should get him in. Beautiful, nice and simple. Okay, I think I think I've worked it out. I hope I've worked it out. So we're gonna make this one levitate in here, and then I'm gonna get the chest to levitate in there. Whoopsies. I'm gonna get the. I said I'm gonna get the chest to levitate in here. Come on, boss. There we go. And then I'm going to Akio again towards me. Right. I actually think I need to push that box underneath it. Which is why there's two there. Can't get to you now, damn it. Oh, what if I quickly Accio you though? Come on, you seem stuck. Oops, not that one. Oh well. It is what it is. I'm thinking the plan is so. This box can stay in here, that's fine. But I think that we need to get this box out from under here. And we're going to... Okay, there we go. Wonderful. Now I think we... Levioso. Levioso him and then we're going to come over here and we're going to Accio. Accio oh okay never mind damn it please let me get the box please let me get the box and then if I Accio this one underneath enough hopefully oh no I'll wait for that to drop and then hopefully if I Levioso that, it'll get it high enough. Levioso. I feel like I did this... It doesn't feel like I did this long ago. No, you're all good, Maddie. I know, I, I've done the same. You know, I've... I don't think I even did this thing. I gave up on it and I just moved on. 
I'm just determined today. <laughs> okay, so now if I try Leviosoing you, will that? Oh, you don't really get much higher, do you? Oh, 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 oh. Maybe? Ah ha ha ha! We did it! We did it, we did it. I got it. It wasn't worth it, but I got it. <laughs> I feel like there's something with a snitch too, but I I don't know what to do with the I snitch. Hope that house elf can find us in here. If there's anything to do with the snitch, I'm more than happy to go back. I will wait until the stream catches up. Okay, awesome. It looks as though it's okay, so I don't think there's anything to do with the snitch. Which is good. That is a good thing. Do you bear with me? I'm oh my goodness. Where's everything gone? Okay, we're good. It's fine. We're Gucci. All righty. How very ominous. <laughs> All right. Time to get our room. Hello, Zeke. What are you doing? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. <sighs> Hello. Ah, oh, Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? <laughs> Look at me like I'm a puppy or something. To meet you. Some Deke new has been zoo a animal. Since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. Aww. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, mm. would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The room of requirement will always be equipped for the seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep seen students in need of an extra oh, pile of potions <laughs> stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as so a like room trick. of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now... It's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Mm. How do I need it? Food. Food is a good thing that I need. Being blind would make him more humble. <laughs> no, he's actually more of a jerk. I know, right? Ominous feels like the spoiled rich kid. Oh, it's so cool! I love it so much. I you never get sick of this game. Quite the 
canvas to work with. Look how proud he is too. So cute. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Oh, do bear with me. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar <laughs> items of clothing. I imagine floor to ceiling one galleons. Right. The effects of anything in which one is clothed. I'm thinking of a nice, delicious meal, but you know, that's fine too, I suppose. Let's identify some gear. Oh, it just identifies it straight away. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Thank you. Time to learn about the room of requirement. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. No, another no. spoiled <laughs> rich kid by the name of country. Bruce Wayne. This is the true. The might not this provide everything true. you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Conjuring. Incredible. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. We did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, <laughs> oh, this is a Bruce it's much Wayne. safer yeah. and easier to purchase them. Yeah. They can also can be collected that. by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I, see. I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You My can homie indeed. Sebastian. <laughs> oh, perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Hmm. We're going to do it safe for now. We're going to conjure a potion. Oh, which one do we want? Gothic, no. Well, what would she do? Karen. I reckon Karen would probably have more botanical. I feel. How do you. Oh, rotate this way. Beautiful. Eclectic? Oh, maybe Karen would have an eclectic. Mm, she wouldn't have a gothic. Karen, Karen. I feel like she have botanical. Mm. This one's a hard one. I'm I'm getting Oh, I forgot that I can change the colour. Oh well. Doesn't matter. And we want a potting table. I'm gonna put this one over here somewhere. And again. No, she wouldn't have a eclectic potting table or a gothic one. Mm, might have the scientific one. Karen. Nah, I think I can see having the scientific one out of these ones. Change the colour though. <laughs> You're gonna pick the most basic one possible, this is true. Okay. Ooh. I love that effect that goes over the whole thing. Purple? Oh, she's gonna have purple, it matches her outfit. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. 
Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Okay. I'd like to know more about Deke, but that's only because we're gossiping. Can you tell me a bit more? About I'm hoping. Him? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell previous you more post. when he's ready. But again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. Okay. Oh, can I use transfiguration magic anywhere? Can I use this type of Asking this for myself, not for her. Side of the room. Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. Huh. We've charms in place to enforce that. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. Mm, that's but fair enough. The room of requirement has its own rules. Again, fair enough. Thank I will you. I'm sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Thank you. That is fantastic. I'm quickly going to save. Incredible. Incredible. Kind of wish they had her glasses. Oh, where'd my music go? Let's get this music going. <laughs> there we go. Of course my music. I do not have nice funky music to close out. That sounds very loud. Let's bring that down just a smidge. Lovely. Kind of wish they had her glasses and an assortment of different colors. Yeah. No, I agree. I really like those glasses too. I think they're great. They, they suit a lot of people too. I find a lot of their glasses are... Uh, I don't know. Some work really well. Some feel like... Yeah. <laughs> Do you have anything exciting planned for the week, Maddie? I'm gonna start wrapping up. I just noticed the time, I've noticed how long that I've been playing and I went, oh, I have things tomorrow. <laughs> Oopsies. It's so easy to get carried away though. I could play this game forever. Forever and ever and ever and ever. Without sleeping. I just love so much that I've got this cape. I can keep it in theme and I really like that. I like that I can stay in theme. Do I have any more tea? I hate it when you go to drink something and it's not there. Can you see too? <laughs> it looks like a chipmunk. I've got like this random bump sort of here on my cheek. My wisdom tooth's coming through and it's all swollen. In like, it feels like a marble under my skin. It's slowly going down some days, but. <laughs> Just the usual gaming gave me a more gaming. Good, good. No, do keep it up. Keep up with the gaming. <laughs> I really appreciate you sitting here all stream, Maddie. That's amazing. I I really do appreciate your support. Thank you so, so much. I want to welcome all the new subscribers as well. I did see that there were some that popped up. I don't get notifications for all of them. Uh, you need to have your YouTube set to public subscriptions or something i don't know it's a weird thing don't stress about it but welcome and i'm so glad to have you guys here as a part of our little community um i didn't mind streaming on youtube i think this is nice i'll definitely be doing this weekly i've got youtube and i've got um twitch as well two streams a week i hope i can keep up with it especially now that i'm going back to full-time work I haven't been off for long. I've been off for like a week and a half. <laughs> but um, I was hoping to be able to spend more time. I had to play a little bit of Dead, Dead by Dead with a friend. 
Oh, that'd be good. I'd love to play a bit of Dead by Daylight. It looks like a lot of fun to play with friends. And I've considered it, potentially. Maybe. Over on Twitch, though, I am going to start streaming. Oh, no, I've got the hiccups. It's a good time to end. <laughs> um... Dang, hiccups. I'm going to be going through Fable. Starting from the first Fable. It's a first playthrough because I haven't... Um... I played the first one when I was really young and I don't really remember it. I remember bits of it. Um, but I haven't played Fable 2 or 3. I started Fable 2 and then the console left for the person so I couldn't finish it and I've never touched Fable 3 so I'm gonna start doing full first playthroughs of that over on my Twitch. Um, not quite sure what we're gonna be continuing to do on YouTube just yet but I hope you enjoyed Hogwarts. Oh Maddie that's so sweet. You're absolutely welcome. I look forward to your streams. I look forward to having you here. It's very, very sweet. I hope you can finally get some sleep. <laughs> and, and that you haven't compromised too much. And I hope you have a wonderful sleep. Never played that game. It's so good. It's From what I remember, it's a really good game. I did pick it up a few months ago. I think I got the anniversary, Fable anniversary. It was on Game Pass or something. Um, yeah no it's awesome it's another rpg it's classic it's gorgeous it's so much fun you'll definitely be watching <laughs> i'd be surprised if you didn't maddie <laughs> for the support instant support that you've been giving me ever since you started watching my streams um but i'm so glad that i could meet you so thank you so much i do really really do appreciate it i hope you have a beautiful week i will be seeing you next week i'll be on twitch next tuesday and then i'll be on youtube begin next thursday and I'm playing most of this by ear at the moment. It's very in between. <laughs> Haven't played Fable 2. I love I did play Fable. Oh, you played 3? And Fable 1, they're both really. They're so good. I love them so much. I'm going to see if there's a way that I can sort of rearrange my, my layout on my monitors. I'm used to having chat right underneath the camera so that at least when I read and talk to chat it's very close whereas now I've got chat all the way on this side and all the way on the other side <laughs> so I don't look even close to the camera <laughs> it's like, yeah right yeah 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 you know that thing that you should probably be doing more often yeah <laughs> instead of watching some random Australian goodness so it would be What, 8? Almost 9am now for you? Is that right? I'm just gauging. <laughs> it was almost 9am for you-ish. If I did a morning stream, that would get your evenings. I might do weekend streams. I might do Saturday morning streams. Like I said, just try interacting with you. Our conversation is pretty hilarious. Oh, I'm so glad. I like bringing a light to people's days. I think it's I think it's important, you know, the um, the real world can get dark sometimes, and sometimes people are going through things. And if I can be a bit of a distraction, even for a little bit, I I it makes me feel really full, and it makes me really happy that I can be a light to people's lives. So thank you. I'm so glad. I'm so glad that you've just come in and just gone. You know what? Here's a bit of banter. We're going to continue it. It's fun. I don't take a lot of things personally. So, no. Thank you. Thank you for your energy and thank you so much for your support. I'm correct. It's about nine. Okay, cool. No, good. That's good. Good for me to know. Because if I do Saturday morning streams here, then it'll be Friday evening for you, which could be a bit more within your time zone <laughs> then right now <laughs> considering you've been up since 4 30 actually you're up earlier than that you're up from midnight so did you think i have a nap at midnight and then just come back <laughs> like four hours later 
Uh, like there's a slight delay too, but that's okay. I say black the doctor. No, this is true. This is true. You did say that. You have said that. <laughs> well, hope that can make your evening awake times go a little bit faster. <laughs> Thank you again so, so much for being here. Uh, I'm going to wrap up, but I will see you next week. We're going to start Fable on Twitch, and then we will continue with... I'll probably continue with some more Hogwarts here for a little bit longer for the interim, and see... see where it takes us. See where we go. It's going to be a bit of hit and miss at the moment, but we're, we'll play it all by ear. See how we go. <laughs> You need to change your stream times. Oh, thank you, Maddie. I do really appreciate it. Your support is so lovely. Everyone's support. I I don't know. I have the best community. <laughs> I love this community so much. <laughs> and I'll always say that. Everyone's so lovely. But I do hope that you can finally get a bit more sleep, Maddie. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week. Enjoy your weekend. That goes for everyone else too. Anyone who's watching this video. I hope you have a wonderful week. Enjoy your weekend. I will see you guys soon. I'm looking forward to this next chapter on YouTube. I think it'll be really good. But I'll see you guys next time. Have a wonderful sleep. Maddie, get some sleep. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out all stream as well. I do really appreciate it. I will see you soon. See you later. Bye. This was really fun. We hope you liked it too. Seems like we've just begun when suddenly we're through. Goodbye, goodbye, good friends, goodbye. Cause now it's time to go. But hey, I say, well that's okay. Cause we'll see you very soon, I know. Very soon, I know. Goodbye, goodbye, good friends, goodbye. goodbye. And tomorrow just might 